Coming in the Hannah. Copyright. <laughs> Gonna get our first strike. Jinx a bitch. Hello. Z Zeke is doing a thing, so we're uh, we're just we're just gonna <laughs> kind of let you guys in on the insanity that happens before uh, our sessions happen. <laughs> I, I know what Matthew Mercer feels like. Odie the thirty tooth. <laughs> you know, metal. I'm not gonna lie. I kind of like that your class icon is your technical difficulties face. <laughs> it it kind of works. <laughs> That's my eternal mode as Odie, anyway. So I mean, re remind me afterwards, and I'll 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 try to remember to make an artificer. I don't know why I didn't think to grab artificer. I just spaced on it. Oh, oh, absolutely. What remind you? Me metal. What do you ha what do you have? Coffee. Oh, well, that's less exciting. That's Is there okay. anything in it? Sadly, no. Oh, no, no Bailey's. That's a shame. I have Bailey's. You could have used. What? Okay. Fuck it. We Fuck have time. <laughs> Couldn't tell Sipping if he was. Sipping cream. Be... I have. I have water. Sipping water. I have flavored water too for backup. Ooh. Yeah, I don't know. I didn't really feel like drinking for some reason. Same. I had the day off, so alcohol. Alcohol. I also had to brave Walmart, so yeah, alcohol. Oh, you poor, poor child. Uh-huh. <laughs> you know, I will admit, seeing you guys posting Spawn Hamburger, um, I have been tempted to fire up stream avatars again, but just put <laughs> all of it behind everything except the background image. So, like, it wouldn't cross over our cameras, it wouldn't cross over the thing, it would just be in the window. Put, I was about to say, put it in the window so they're running back and forth mm -hmm. in the window. But I, I was going to have it be, like, super long anyway, so that, like, it'd be random when they just sort of popped in. Yeah. Do it. Can, can a you do treat. it? I mean, do it right now. Okay. Do you have this, the, the hamburger sprite? Oh, fuck no. <laughs> okay, cool. Um, I think on stream avatars, like, in the Steam Workshop, it's just... Uh, like a dinosaur pack. Hold on. Let me I don't launch. even know that I still have that installed. I do have it installed. It keeps patching itself. Anyway, hi everyone. Join us in the Discord. You said it was just a dinosaur Discord. pack? I can't hmm? spell dinosaur. There's no E in dinosaur. D-E-I-N-E-S-E-R. I think I found the dinosaur. <laughs> Fuck I off. get it. The dinosaur. <laughs> Why you have to? Do you not like this. that? You don't like the dinosaurs? I'm really gonna have to remember to cut this part out from the podcast so they don't have to. Maybe I'll st stick it on like the very end. I'll leave like a 15 second break and then just add this and see who actually hears it. <laughs> yeah, for real. Yeah, I changed the girls' intro. poop setup. Oh, so what? They're not shitting on camera anymore. Oh, they are. They have no, a very shitting. prominent view during the stream of your children shitting. I mean, I mean, it. Yeah, looks good. You should have given them like a toilet seat to see if they'd like hop on it and just. <laughs> no. You're tempted. I saw that look. You're thinking. Yes. <laughs> it's hopefully to help. Rhea to actually use it, and she did it for the first night. And Yay. then... Okay. She nope. started pooping and peeing on the mat again, so it was like, uh, fuck me. I am ready. Are you? Gentle is not back yet. Okay. I am also ready, with my coffee spiked like a field goal. Touchdown, shut up. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I have to do a bunch oh. of, like, API updates and stuff, and since Zeke is ready, this is just gonna have to wait. Here you go. Uh, okay. Next time. Next so, time. sorry everyone for the delay and me I'll just typing away like a madman here. Dare you! Okay, we're not talking to you. Enough. I'm talking to them, yeah, even though them is usually us because we're all, they're usually the ones watching the Twitch. Anyway, um, <laughs> to all of our podcast listeners, <laughs> uh, welcome to Fools, Fools and, and Flagons, flagons. a yeah. very weird, 
a very weird and crazy D and D podcast where we roll dice and I try to make sense of what these morons do. Wow. Um, wow. You're welcome. Wow. I don't know. Uh, so, just to give you a rundown of what we're all about, we live stream our D and D campaigns every Friday on Twitch, alternating between Tales of Artron, which is done by that goober over there, Ian. And Storm King's Chaos, a uh, take on Storm King's Thunder module that I have uh, taken a, taken a, quite a few creative liberties with. <laughs> um, both are available to watch again on our YouTube channel or listen to our podcast form on most major platforms a week later. Uh, if I forgot to say, hello, my name is Zeke. I'll be your DM for the night or day or morning whenever you're listening or watching this. <laughs> Uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, on top of streaming D&D on Fridays, we also stream a variety of games during the week with Pez Plays on uh, Tuesday and on the weekends with Metallurgy Magic. If you like what we do and would like to support us, consider donating to our coffee page. It's not pronounced, well, it's not spelled like you would think. It's spelled K-O-F-I at ko-fi.com slash foolsandflagons. Links can be found below in the doobly-doo. Uh, go support our Kofi. Yes, Please. support our Kofi page. <laughs> we appreciate. Buy Issa uh, and metal their spiked coffees. This isn't coffee; it's just straight whipping cream. <laughs> you animal! You, All right, so proud. What? It's uh, don oh, sorry. Donations are never required, but always appreciated. Always required, never appreciated. Thank you. Uh, all proceeds from donating and memberships go straight back into making fools and flat fools and flagons, fools and flagons, an even better experience, uh, and it helps keep the podcast alive and well. Trust me, we do not make enough off of this to put anything in our pockets, and it wouldn't go into our pockets anyway. It all goes back into creating a better experience for anyone listening or watching. We want to thank you for your follow, subscriptions, and bits on Twitch. We do apologize. We cannot recognize them on stream for the sake of not interrupting the story, but your support of us is always appreciated. And usually there is at least one or two goobers in the chat anyway telling you hi and thank you. I should know, because on the alternating nights, I am that goober. Uh, all right. Did I miss anything, anyone? <laughs> you missed Brian taking a shit on stream. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> I mean, she censored it. A lovely image. It was censored. Cats, man. Hello, TikTok. <laughs> it was censored through Kayla Vision. Please make that into a TikTok. <laughs> okay. I'm making a note. Breed shitting. <laughs> oh, my goodness. And timestamp. The chaos. <laughs> 14 Welcome minutes to... in, Bridge shitting. <laughs> Welcome to this thing. <laughs> and I now introduce to you this fucking, this fucking thing. thing. <laughs> you think it's water. It's actually hard liquor. Vodka. See, he doesn't drink anymore. Right. Does anyone have anything else before we move on? No, I want to destroy the world. Well, that is something. We'll get there eventually. Tomorrow, either Sea of Thieves or Minecraft. Join us. Anyway. Yeah. Anything else? Is it? All right. There's poop Everyone? on everything. Recap? Yes. Everyone, grab your drinks and raise your flagons. It's time for Fools and Flagons. I did it right this time. No, you didn't. I have a mug. Grab your drinks and raise your glasses. It's time for Fools and Flagons. You said flagons. That doesn't flag. rhyme. <laughs> yes, it does. Anyway, moving on. Get drinks and you grab your it glasses. It's time for Fools and Flasses. Uh, <laughs> I should have just stuck. I should have stuck with fucking dragons. All right. Anyway, last week, or actually, four weeks ago now, month ago, How three long weeks. It been? I don't know. Three weeks. Anyway, last we left our smooth-brained adventurers. Yeah. <laughs> also, just a little bit of context. I was asking them before the stream, "What's another word for stupid?" So they had just supplied their own demise. Th please and thank you. Uh, I take that as a compliment. Last we left our smooth-brained adventurers, they left the city of Mirabar and traveled south to uh, Xantharl's Keep. I misspelled that in when I typed it up. Anyway. And you called us smooth brains. Yeah, it's okay. I'm, I'm one of you. Uh, when they arrived, they were rushed inside the walls as there was a giant attack approaching. The giant had gathered a small army of ogres and goblinoids uh, to attack the city. Our party quickly realized that the attack was a little strange 
uh, and quickly surmised that it was actually a distraction and proceeded to suss out the actual threat. Tin After bugbears went alive. <laughs> tin bugbears had snuck inside the keep to kidnap a dwarf. After rescuing the dwarf, uh, Ruin realized it was the Weevil, a criminal that had gathered the attention of, and sometimes ire, of many organizations in the North for his daring heist. After rescuing him, Ruin used leverage to not only take the money he had stolen, but also press the Weevil into his service. Peanut and Odie then proceeded to curb stomp the giant and take all of his stuff. <laughs> I got a mug. We rejoin the party wheel. the morning <clears throat> after they have enjoyed the free room, food, and ale that Being Heroes has afforded them. Party, what would you like to do? Party. Uh, oh, we had a long rest? You did have a long rest. A successfully long rest. Thank God, I was almost out of rage. No shenanigans. <laughs> There's only so much what? rage that can be inside a little thing at one time. That's not <laughs> true. I, uh, hmm. <laughs> it's only four. <laughs> um... <laughs> Um, do we... Was I used as a pillow? <laughs> I don't know, Ruin. Probably. <laughs> just, just... Eh. Catch Odie oh, knitting God. up some new known spells. <laughs> That's it. I want to sleep in my mug. In your mug? Uh, your, I I'll think we have to partially fix that for fixed. You. <laughs> yeah, I made some progress. <laughs> there, there's just a leg sticking out of one of the holes. <laughs> <laughs> just little toe beans. So, uh, do we... Do we stay here for any reason, or can we just move on? I think from here, we're cutting through the forest. I don't well, think we've got any business here. Do we have to cut through the forest, or can we just like go around it? I'm not complaining, it's just a basket. There is a safe route, a safer route at the south. And then we just kind of curve around. Yeah, I mean, if we follow the... If, huh? you, if, uh, if you look at your map, oh, there, there is a much longer way to your destination of uh, Everlund slash Zimorvium Hall. Those are the two places you have been advised to go. Um, <clears throat> cutting through... The Lurkwood would be the more direct route. Um, however, if you do want to stay on the road, you would have to go around the entirety of the Evermores, as there is no uh, safe road through. And we will be there for Evermore. Well, I guess it's about time we take a vote then. Do we go through the forest and have possibly more things to fight? Or do we... Or things to fight. Forest. I mean, you know, I can always burn it down. Forest. We're 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 both for it. Your cousin forest. burned down a prison. I don't think. Uh... Your cousin. <laughs> well, I'd be following in his footsteps then. <laughs> Your family debt is starting to skyrocket. Uh, okay, I need strong. hands. Come on, people. Forest. Oh, these are my hands. The package has been delivered. <laughs> Come on, Jeffrey Bezos. God damn it. Um, I mean, forest sounds fine to me. I mean, that was where we were headed. And Does otherwise, anybody... give... Sorry. Yeah. That's fine. I didn't hear anybody say no. So forest it is. Well, I Can didn't I have anybody down? raise their fucking hands when I asked either. Hello, peanut. I'd give him a tap on the shoulder. But eh, you don't count. These hands okay. are weapons. You do not want them. I just they wanted to are erase... also voting <laughs> tools. Well, I mean, to be fair, if they were weapons with him being, you know, all rage happy, wouldn't he want them? Because, you know, more weapons. <laughs> From out of the mug. Gib. <laughs> <laughs> give me our dear mittens. <laughs> Wait, I don't see it here. Listen. I'll make soft paws. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> yes, that is your name now. I'll make soft paws. You'll think they're soft until he punches you. 
punch, guess, punch. And then, the, then the soft punches will begin. I'm a, uh, I'm gonna go fight a guard. Well, fight the guard. With a uh, where are you all having hat. this conversation? I'm in my uh, bug. Are you in, not, are, did you consolidate not in the room? It. Did you consolidate uh, in the in common area? Well, I mean, I was taking on these rooms. I'm gonna head. let fate going decide right. something here. Decided. Peanut would have tried to bring the mug into the tavern and just sleep inside in the mug. <laughs> I know, but I'm asking like, where are we grouped? Where right is now? the mug relative to it, the rest of the tavern? In the tavern, <laughs> just like in, in place of a chair, just okay. mug. Okay, so, so y'all are in the common area. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Is so, anybody listening in on us? There's not really many other people. Um, not really a popular stop other than out of necessity although as your conversation ends uh the door does swing open and in you walks... step on a creaky floorboard <laughs> um, uh in walks a a dwarf flanked by uh two uh guards much like the dwarves? ones you saw on top of the wall sorry sure are they also dwarves no these are these oh. one is a half orc and the other is a human uh, they are flanking this dwarf, big gray beard uh, with a lot of braids and uh, jewelry in it, um, long hair pulled up into a bun, uh, seems to be wearing armor and have a cape, so seems to be of some sort of station and a large uh, two-handed great axe on his back. Uh, he kind of looks around, uh, sees you guys, the only people in here besides... Um, a, uh, a half orc woman behind the counter and walks up. You would be the um, fellows who helped us Mercs out. Mercs for, uh, for hire. Yes. yes. How can we help you, young man? Don't Mercs ask. Sass. Sass? I'm older than you, probably. I probably. Very hard to believe. Well, then how old are you? Oh, it's true. We call him Grandpa all the time. Oh, is he one of those elf-like thingies? Yeah. No, not an elf. Yeah. yeah. No! You guys are yeah. all stupid. I'm part dragon. Fuck Denial you. is the first stage to acceptance. What just, is the just, let it out. <laughs> just let it out. Just let it out. There are no ears there. It's a glamour. <laughs> it's all the bunny ears on his head. It's glamour. Anyway. I, uh... My name is Norbeck Horn. I'm the lord here. I report to the Matron of Mirabar, so I came to find out who you were, so I knew how to report accurately. You said you're the... Sorry, Mercs for Hire? Yeah, Mercs, Mercs for Hire. For hire. With, a, with a Z. The, it's Mercs with a Z. Oh, he doesn't spell What's his good. name? It's uh, Harbor right. Narbeck Horn. Nar... N-A-R... Nar... Narbeck. N-A-R-B-E-C-K. Horn. Um, with a silent K. Mercs for hire. It's a, it's a little <laughs> on the nose, isn't it? It is how we like it. I mean, it's true. There's a ring to it. No one's Fair confused enough. about what we are. No, well, mm, I mean, like walking through a city, going Mercs for hire. I mean, to be fair, uh, Peanut's gonna point at Erdal. We're still a little confused about him. Hey, home here. Well, I mean, too. Anyway, Wait. hi. All right. Um, apologies for not being able to offer you any monetary compensation, but I hope the free room and board and food and drink on uh, the city's tab is was enough. Ale's fine with me. It was, it was, it was a good fight. It was a pretty good fight. It wasn't like sleeping on money or anything like that, but it was okay. So, speaking of, uh, no cost to you, of course, but we're, we're, we're planning on trudging on through your your little backyard forest over there. Uh, the the Lurkwood. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Are you insane? Well, my I suggestion mean, was to burn it all down. I mean, okay, to be fair, did you not see me flying through the air to kill your little giant problem? It was Good a big point. giant. I want Don't big know things if that to help you out much, but... Uh, okay. I mean... Sir... Recent happenings. I was gonna, Peanut's just gonna sit on the edge of his his giant stein. And go, tell me what's in there. Ah. 
I got no clue. But uh, Mommy, I'll see then how do you know it's dangerous? No one's ever come back out. Well, what if it's really nice in there and they just didn't want to come out? But that's why they didn't come out. Factory. Nobody ever goes in. in hookers. Oh, plenty of morons go in. Just none of them ever come out the other side. Well, yeah, like I said, what if it's really nice? You want to make a bet? What? Oh no. He kind of gives you a look. Make a persuasion check. Oh. With advantage. No. Pack tactics. Oh, man, it's 14. 14? What kind of a bet? <laughs> As he eats a sandwich. I wasn't finished with that. Uh, Which will get you another one. I'm, I'm just thinking like 10 gold that if we make it back through here and, you know, we're not dead. <laughs> Lightweight. Ten gold. If you make okay, fine. Yeah. If you come back here, if I see you alive again after watching you, if after my guards watch you into the woods and you end up back here again, sure. Ten gold. Sweet. Easiest ten. Is this gold one of these like made. college initiation things that we need to as a, as a rule? Naked. You can't just step foot in the forest and then come right back out. You actually have to go through. No cheating. Oh yeah, I got oh, shit to do. Glad. All right. Glad we understand each other. Is this well, one of those college initiations? Do we need oh. to, like, streak through it? <laughs> Close uh, on, please. Trust me, boy. Right. You're going to need all the armor and weapons you can find. I mean, I just got cloth, cloth stuff on. It's kind of nice. Yeah. And no, this isn't just recent. This has been going on as far back as I can remember. So, I'll bet you your house that we do it. No. My yeah. head's almost out of ink. Hey, tell me, behave. Like I said, I'll burn that damn forest down. <laughs> Ill advised. I'll let you That's sleep it. in the house if you come back. Do I get the big bed? I mean, they're all pretty big. Okay, then deal. Ooh. All I right. Should have music playing, but I don't. Ba -do 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 -do. Wait, do you have a treasury have here? Enough. A what? A treasury? A place with all of your not, money? Not really. Most of it's, uh, if anything does come through here, it's usually gone straight up to Mirabar. Damn. We're more of an extension of the city. Uh, <clears throat> okay, never mind. Anyways, um, thank you again for all your help. Good luck. Yep, got myself you a nice little it. souvenir. I oh. slapped the shit out of the side of my tankard. <laughs> And, um... <laughs> Odie was back. tinkering on it, just... <laughs> <laughs> if you do end up coming back, um... Hope you got a tail for me. I do, I'm it's curious. right here. Aridol, shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, um... <laughs> he, <clears throat> he looks over at the, uh, at the half-orc behind the counter Arastra have a good day and he walks out Salute. hi so uh should we get going I got 10 gold to win are you still streaking he did say you were streaking right no no he said we no, need all the armor we can get uh, shit you guys are terrible at Gaslighting him. Anyway, go through the forest. I would just prefer everyone keep their clothing on, please. All right. <laughs> Peanut is dragging his mug out. I make no promises! Um, I mean, covered in fur. Point of order. Uh, what are you guys doing with the horse and wagon? Horses would, and wagon. Will it not fit through the forest? I don't uh, think that's it, wise. It will make... It will... Uh, uh, anyone here good at survival or nature? I'm good at burning things away in front of us. <laughs> I'm all right at anyone survival. Proficient? I'm proficient in survival. Okay. As well. You would know that trying to take a wagon <clears throat> through the forest is ill-advised, as it can often slow and impede your travel, as wagons are made for the roads, not for forests uh, with no clear path. The horses... You might get away with. 
Can I tinker up some tires? <laughs> <laughs> Off road, that bitch. <laughs> a rubber hasn't Wait. been invented in this world, so I'm going to say no. Wait, for the horses or for the cart? Yeah, put the tires on the horse. <laughs> it's Tears of the Kingdom, the shit. Off-road horses. <laughs> Looney Tunes, See that horse is fumbling. <laughs> a motorcycle. A horse cycle. <laughs> Some farmer just hears noise in the woods. Tiny penis. <laughs> <laughs> That is Florida in a nutshell. <laughs> <laughs> Thou must be compensating, sire. <laughs> Wait, what was hey. the lady's name again? Siren. Uh, <laughs> oh, Bar. I thought you said Bard. Um, Arzastra. Arzastra. <laughs> Miss Ar Arzastra. Yeah, I'm gonna help you. That's not what I expected the voice to sound like. Um, is there somewhere we can keep the horses in the cart that we have that won't cost us an arm and a leg? I mean, technically, boss didn't give you any time limit on the room and board, so I guess you could just keep him there for free. Thank you. Can you, can you just make sure that they don't die and they're somewhat fed? Somewhat. I, I can do that. I think I lost my, <laughs> um, my helper. I think I went to see the dwarf around. I mean, well, there was the one we were just talking to. No, no, little guy. Really pitiful looking. Kind of skinny. There was that guy we were just talking to. Oh, yeah. He, he he might be indisposed for a long time. Oh, that's a shame. He was really pitiful. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta help out for him. Hey, uh. <laughs> so easily manipulated. You got any rope? I could buy off of you. It doesn't have to be well, good. I've got some rope. You back. That'll be a minute. I'm just imagining this half orc chick has no teeth. <laughs> like she has one tusk and that's about it. Oh, okay. <laughs> so oh. <great. laughs> got a snaggle tooth. Well, shit, I just realized I already have rope. Well, I'll buy it off her anyway. I she also comes, have rope. She comes back <laughs> with like a really frayed ratty rope. I got this. Yeah, they'll pass. Thank you, though. I'll take it. it for it's, it's not long enough. Seven <laughs> copper? Ew. <laughs> <laughs> How many feet of ratty rope do I get? <laughs> it's 50 copper. feet. It's 50 feet of rope. Whether or not well, it'll hold anything. Best purchase of the game so far. Oh, it is. It'll be good for tying up bandits. Biatches. 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 I'm going to spend a minute or two to uh, turn my giant mug into a backpack, put all my stuff in oh. that. Oh my god. Oh, I see what you're doing here. Yeah. <laughs> Just looking at Rude, I'm bringing this with me. <laughs> <laughs> if you. If you can carry it. I mean, technically, you can carry it. You don't have to sleep in it. With no help. With no help. What do you I, mean? I'm, how much can you carry? I'm happily offering this help. No, we're not offering. Uh, my carry capacity is 240, and I can push drag or lift 480. <laughs> it's just um, a wooden mug. It's I'll not full. <laughs> well, you're putting stuff in it, right? You're putting all your well, stuff in my it? My stuff, which would be on my back yeah. anyway. Yeah. Cause it's 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 like a giant. It's like if a giant had a mug. Yeah. Like it's big. Yeah. It's, it's a, a bubble man. home. It's a bubble I'll home. Say, <laughs> I'll say. I'll ev say. Uh, for every day you're carrying it with you on foot, you have to make a uh, a strength check to see how well that day you you do. All right. So you can you can carry two forty. How close are you to that two forty limit? I'm not even halfway. Not even halfway? I'll give you advantage, but you're still basically like lifting, dragging, carrying it. Well, that's why I made little day. backpack straps. Okay. I'll give you. I'll give you a string check. I'll give you a string check at advantage every day, just in, just in case something funny happens. <laughs> <laughs> you remember? All right. <laughs> C 
can I hear that by any chance? No. <laughs> They're all shaking their heads at me. No, you can't. No, you can't. Uh, no, my passive perception is 12. I don't hear dick. <laughs> <laughs> I do. All right. What, you hear dick? Just yes. in the distance. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Anything else? Nope. All right. So you all head out. Uh, so you're leaving both the the wagon and the horses, or are you taking the horses? Leave the wagon and horses. Leave wagon. You could always all eat right. them. <laughs> no. Well, I mean. So, <clears throat> As you make your way. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so, you all make your way back to the road and then across, entering the Lurkwood. Excuse me. You're excused. As you enter, um, it's. It's not a quick transition. It's. There are sporadic trees about, and the canopy's not too thick for the first mile or so. And then it's so gradual that it creeps up on you and then you it is the canopy is thick, very little sunlight is getting through, maybe a beam here or Don't there. Be thick. <laughs> uh the tr the trees and vines overgrown. Uh sometimes you're having to push through underbrush. It's a it's um a little bit more than you were expecting. Uh, so, since we are traveling off the road, I do need someone to make a survival check to see how well uh, you can keep on course uh, and how me. fast you travel. I got you. Okay. No, go ahead, actually. <laughs> okay. No, I, I mean, seriously, I got a natural 20, but I want him to go. <laughs> I also got a natural 20. Let's go. <laughs> okay. Plus five. They're, they're loudly arguing about the correct way to go, which is, they're both like, no, we go this way. I know, we're going that way. Thank you. <laughs> You're wonderful. <laughs> You're an uh, excellent tracker. <laughs> so, you feel like you're keeping a pretty steady pace. Um, you're going, and you make good, you feel like you made good progress. Um... Or you get to in the cup. <laughs> toss a pebble in the cup. Uh, make a slide of hand. Say, yeah, I was, say, I was trying to decide if this would be uh, <laughs> an, almost an attack or a slide of hand, but I'm going to go with slide of hand. Okay, I've got good insight. Uh, you're 19. 19. I mean, my passive you... perception is 12. You like chuck it in, and it like hits a, the bag or something soft so it kind of just like you, you, you see it go in but it doesn't make a thunk sound so you're in, it's fine you're in cognito <laughs> <Kobe. laughs> I just love the thought of it gradually getting worse until they're chucking boulders at me I'm <laughs> just gonna, gonna elbow rude a little bit Do it. <laughs> <laughs> All the neck is just like like lurking behind them. Do it. <laughs> Can I find like this day. Odie's at the branch. front, just like. So do you think we go? Where the fuck did Old Mike go? <laughs> <laughs> Can I find like a branch that I'm just kind of like getting in and not hitting the edges to just lay it down really, really softly? Yeah, you can you can easily find a branch. Make a slide of hand check. <laughs> Natural 20. <laughs> it was a lot bigger than of a branch than you thought. It's a log. Like, you, actually, you find a pretty a thick log. piece of wood. that It's barely even a branch at that point. It's more like a full limb. and you Like a piece of a full limb. You're just slowly walking behind him. Slowly place it in and then back away. <laughs> Man, this is getting a lot heavier than I thought it would. <sighs> How much longer are uh, we going for today? <laughs> about Maybe this time, I'm actually going to ask Ian, can you make a... Uh, can you You're going to ask who? Check in... Sorry, Peanut. That I think I should get advantage. Uh, double advantage since you fucked up my name. No, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> ha! No, fuck you! Natural 20! 
Which, All right. Wait, was it a check yeah, or a one. save? Check. Oh, then uh, 23. 23. <clears throat> so, yeah, it's it's getting a little heavier. Like, huh, this is huh. It's taking more out of me than I thought. But you know what? You're yeah. chucking along. You're you're good to go. <laughs> <laughs> He's a beast. Yeah, you, just, you also there. see this little, this little otter folk with his backpack <laughs> twice his <the> size. <laughs> <laughs> we just get there, Peanut's just like, man, fuck that forest was messy. <laughs> <laughs> So. Fuck you guys. <laughs> As you're going, uh, you do notice the angle of the sunbeams has slowly been tilting to where you, you notice the sun's probably going down very quickly. Um, oh, oh, sorry. What do you want, Rune? <clears throat> no. The angle of the sunbeams. <laughs> I'm making fun of you. I'm sorry. I'm the angle of the dangle. I'm sorry. I grew up where I could go in the forest all the time, so I know this stuff. Shut up. Oh, I was praising Not the sun. Put <laughs> <laughs> the title. The angle. The sunbeams. Oh, right now it's either off-road horses or your package has been delivered. <laughs> <laughs> um, that might have a double entendre. Uh, <clears throat> uh, we'll see how this session goes, I guess. Uh, oh, God. Anyway, as you are traveling you know a sun you know a sign the sun's beginning to go down um what are you doing looking around oh my god what what it's your turn oh you guys think we should uh camp out soon or or what (laughs) No, no, we're okay um, for a little longer. You're doing such a good job. We're actually kind of impressed that you're able to carry that thing as well as you are. <laughs> Bitch, please, this is nothing. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, Mitchell. <laughs> I grab a log. <laughs> <laughs> How many hey. natural 20s are we having tonight? What'd you roll? Oh, I, I had six choices, so I rolled a d6. Oh, you grab. Oh, you haven't even oh, rolled your okay. like yet. <laughs> no, no. That, that was okay, just so I'll grab. say I'll say you grab like a good size, prob- probably about this size log. Not a huge it's log, but a, thick. it's thick. It's thick. What is stealth? Hey, make a stealth check. Stand behind him. No, come back. No. <laughs> well, that wasn't very stealthy. <laughs> No, that's you your log. <laughs> off into the forest. Rachel, I love you. Fifteen plus six. Twenty-one. All right. <laughs> Twenty-one. So you slowly lower this giant-ass log right next to the limb, and they're both just kind of sticking out at odd angles. <laughs> and Peanut, you're like, hey, you really want to, you really want to find a place to stop. Kind of, kind of dig into the shoulders a little bit. <laughs> No, Peanut, it's okay. You got this. I believe in you. Mark's for hire. <laughs> Damn right. Hey, hey, Siren. <laughs> yeah. Siren. You want to say yeah. it yet? No. Mark's for hire. Come on, you're the only one that hasn't given it yet. Mark's for hire. I'm waiting for the right moment. I swear it Mark's better be a battle an cry answer. as you kill something. Uh-huh. <laughs> 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 Merch for hire. <laughs> Shatter! <laughs> we make it through like 50 <laughs> sessions as we're killing the fucking big bad evil guy. She's just like, Merch for hire, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> the ultimate, how do you want to do this? <laughs> All right. <laughs> What's happening? I've lost track. Uh, gonna Sorry, find a good, good spot to go rest. All right. Yes. Uh, I'll say with the two amazing survival checks from earlier, you don't have any trouble finding a decent spot to. Are set you up sure? The night. They seem pretty distracted. <laughs> I'm fine. They're taking turns. Don't worry about it. I've Mind been paying attention. Um, Odie is astutely observing the route. So you find a pretty okay spot to bed down for the night. Uh, Peanut, go ahead and make a perception check for me. As you, as you put the backpack down. Okay. What, like, I'm not going to notice the... Well, okay, I guess I'm not going to notice the loss. <laughs> <laughs> what 
<laughs> roll. That's a six. <laughs> no, you look over and like you, you put the bag down and, you, and you're just like, yep, it's yeah, it's there. We're good. Okay, what's next? <laughs> oh, hey, sweet, I got repair materials. <laughs> I'm gonna crawl in and see if any of them will fit in the holes. Um, yeah, you could probably cut the log up into planks if you tried it out, right? Hey, hey, Odie. Ah, uh. you uh, <laughs> I'm holding up one of the logs. I'm gonna give it a hand. Who the fuck did you get that? I don't know. It was in the bug. The forest provides. All right. <laughs> I'll take first watch during the night and. Uh, <laughs> During one of the nights, I'll just whittle away into, law, into planks. Jesus Christ. If that's provides. not the title, I'm so angry. <laughs> I'm trying to write it down, but I'm kind of, my eyes are watering. <laughs> I'm gonna go get some firewood. <laughs> you can't have mine. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, yeah. I'll say you go get some. Oh, God, I can't talk. I'm gonna help him get firewood. 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 <laughs> well, it is air at all. It could be firewood. Um, Siren, we have to look hard. There's a word out here. He sneezes funny and he just fire. <laughs> Incantation. <laughs> For any Skyrim fans, he just goes, yo, and fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sure. Okay, cool. Uh, Where were we? So, you're uh, getting firewood with Siren. I'm on first watch, and I'm carving up a plank out of the log. Oh, yes, who, who, okay, so you're taking first watch. Who is taking what else watches? Uh, you need uh, three watches. I'll do middle watch with Rune. Okay. I can do third. I'll do third as well. <clears throat> All right. I guess I'm getting full night's sleep. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I got uh, you so doing this alone. So you, you, you know. Forge provides. <laughs> <laughs> you set up. Um... <laughs> it's still getting me. <laughs> oh, man. You deserve a full night's sleep after all of the hard work you've done today. <laughs> <laughs> why? Why are you? Why are you waking at him? He has something oh in his God. eye. What? Oh, why? Did, it, did, it, did oh, okay. I do something? You don't blink like this? No. No. <laughs> Maybe if you're a frog. I'm not it's not normal for dragons. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. So you get the firewood, you get the fire going, you set up sure camp. Sure, on one tonight. Yeah, apparently. <clears throat> I'm tired. <laughs> That's making me giggly. Um, <clears throat> so Odie takes first watch. I need you to roll a perception check for the night. And tools. <laughs> and tools. Uh, roll, yeah. roll. Yeah, we are. He's done. It was in the. What? Hmm. Not when you're done. Sorry. Okay. Okay. Oh, uh, that'll be for the tools. That'll be nine. And it makes for okay progress. Watch sixteen. Sixteen. Hmm. Okay. So as you're working there, um, you you you're working away. You're whittling. It's not going great. This isn't the best wood. It's not super dry. It's it's still kind of wet, which is making the, the process a little awkward. Um, and you don't get as much progress as you wanted because <clears throat> as you're whittling away, actually, yeah, uh, as you're whittling away, you th think you hear footsteps. You look around. Everyone else is still asleep. Yo. You just hear, like... You just hear... Let me turn off CRISPR for this. <clears throat> if I can find where it is. Let me close my window for this, too, because I got some loud-ass fucking neighbors. CRISPR, where art thou? There you are. Yeah. 
you hear you so you're sitting there whittling away and then you hear I go and investigate. So you you get up from the fire and you go and you look around. You don't see anything. Mm -hmm. And then from the other side of the camp. As that happens, I'm going to cast fairy fire in that direction. Okay. Uh, Is that a save? Uh, each object in 20 foot cube is outlined in blue or green violet light. Um, what's the distance? Uh, it is a range of 60 feet and a 20 foot cube. Okay. Um, <clears throat> dexterity saving throw of 14. Okay. So you quickly turn around. And whoosh, this, this array of dotted lights just flashes through the uh, through the forest waking everyone yeah. else up yeah. um, and it just hits the, the trees and the bushes and lights up the forest you look around nothing else what the hell I don't know ask our visitors I'm not gonna need your lights I might just sleep. Did, did he hit my butt? wake the fuck <laughs> uh, a couple of things around the campfire got like hit by a few dots, but most of it was ended up on the other side of the of the camp in the trees. Peanut's gonna crawl up out of his mug. The fur is just kind of like s- sticking up on one side from where we're sitting. The pebble is stuck on his forehead. <laughs> <laughs> I'll allow it. <clears throat> Comes out of his little arm pocket. <laughs> Yeah, joke's um, on you. I got a clab crusher now, bitch. Is the is the fire still roaring? Right. Um. Yeah. It's well. It's not roaring. It's it's there. It's not a huge fire, but it's also not smoldering. It's that in between space where it gives good light. If I cast meowing. create, if I cast create bonfire there, can I bring it to full blaze again? Oh. Uh. Yeah. So you you cast bonfire and it goes up to. <laughs> Lights up some of the undergrowth around you. And I'll you double on that. I'll <clears throat> cast control flames and double the brightness. Uh oh. Again. Okay. <laughs> At that point, uh, everyone, you hear a couple of interesting noises all at the same time. Mm-hmm. You hear something fucking giggling because I'm out. You hear no. You hear hissing. You. <laughs> it, as it runs farther away from the camp. Tell me here, kitty. And, and now, now you heard it not only on the forest floor, you heard it in the trees, like on the branches and limbs. Does Stare everyone hear that? Or just me? No, no, everyone everyone who wakes up hears it. Like a, no, a no, weird no, no, hissing. No. And then... No, no, no. <laughs> well, I don't think they like fire too much or being in the light. I can't tell and which. And you notice at this point, as soon as the fire goes up, you you didn't notice it before, but the trees themselves actually bend away from the fire. Uh-huh. I think we need to go straight for this. Hang on. <laughs> <laughs> and you, so you actually hear in the forest like some creaking and groaning as if you have angered something. That's right. right. You get away from my fire. Detect thoughts. Okay. Uh, what's the range of detect thoughts? Uh, and do you have to see them? Even fire crackling. Very nice. Uh, yeah. See them within 30 feet. You have to see them within 30 feet. Okay. <clears throat> Um, what you get is less words and more emotion. <clears throat> Odie shitting his pants is an emotion. <laughs> <laughs> and it's not something you're used to. You're used to like hearing surface thoughts of, <clears throat> of other humanoids and sentient beings. This is more just brief intense flashes of emotion of anger uh pain um 
weariness and followed by more anger. And, and you get the feeling it has a lot to do with the fire. Okay. Okay, so what's the plan here? We got hissing trees and bright as fire. What? What? We, what are we doing? I'm gonna look at the tree. Oh. That's that's right. <clears throat> Fuck me, I'll burn your asses down. Don't, Don't take no shit from fucking trees. <laughs> the forest itself seems to groan at you. I smack Aaron on the sho shoulder. <laughs> I remember hey. that shut the fuck up thing. No. Fucking trees. That's right. Fuck all your bitches up. <laughs> Peanut's just gonna look bleary eyed up at the trees. Kill him, not us. He does not share our opinions. <laughs> I wish the spell magic mouth was magic shut mouth. Uh... <laughs> oh, hang on. I can. <laughs> Help with that. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, well, I don't know if uh, it's safe to rest here for the night. You can get some more firewood, throw it in the fire. Just it sounded like they ran away. Yeah. I don't they might come think... back, though. I don't think... Oh, we're gonna get much, um, preve anywhere else. It sounds like they don't like the fire. Uh, keep well, the fire big. It yep. Feels keep like that bitch going. Like I'm going back to bed. Fire. He just slips, Peanuts slips back down in his mug. Oh my god, Peanuts the fucking mouse from Alice in Wonderland. <laughs> <laughs> his little teacup. It's not a teacup, uh, it's a beer mug. <laughs> it's a doormat. You guys get some rest. Oh I'll make, do, you, do you mind sharing the first watch with me <coughs> after this? Nope. Old Mac. Oh. I made biscuits here. You made biscuits? You're cozy. Never mind. <laughs> Man, I'll, I'll wake y'all up if I hear so much as a skitter. Actually, about this time, you realize, no, my watch is done. I'm going to bed. <laughs> <laughs> That's and this is the reason why you did not make much progress on the tools. <laughs> I'm going back to bed. Wake me up. In third watch happens. You know. Uh, fine. He like crawls up over the edge and just does like the limp body just. <laughs> Onto the ground, <laughs> just a little poof of floor dust. <laughs> it's good. If you weren't gonna wake up, I was gonna pour you out of that mug. <laughs> <laughs> nope, nope. It's like big, big, like full body stretch on his back. I'll be fine. And then just like sits bolt upright. Okay. <clears throat> and I believe Siren was taking second watch with you. Rune. Third. Yeah. Third. She's... Rune is Rune. That's why I woke up. Yeah. Gotcha. All right. Good night. Mm -hmm. So the rest of you are going back to sleep while Peanut and Ruin stay up. I need either a perception check from each of you, or one gets advantage. Oh fuck uh, no, Ruin's getting advantage. I'm assuming you're. And are you continuing indeed. without magic to st or with magic to stoke the fire now that the other two have gone back to sleep? Actually, funny story. Twenty-one. Twenty-one. <laughs> I have thaumaturgy. Okay. Every minute. Pew! Brighter. Pew! All right. Um, I help with that. I have thaumaturgy, too. Okay. Oh, now, he's does thaumaturgy make it hotter, <laughs> bigger, or just brighter? Uh, Flames to flicker, brighten, dim, or change color. So, okay, so, it's, so for, it's the first, for the first little while, just brighter. But afterwards, just going to start just being like, blue. Okay. Cake. So the flames die down a little bit. Uh, just start having a, a color bright. A color war with Rune, just like hell. No. As as the flames <laughs> die down from it no longer being sustained by bonfire and control fire, you do see the trees slowly start to lean back in 
and reform the holes in the canopy that were left. Yep, sorry about that. I did do it. Uh, <laughs> one more time. <laughs> one more time, Rune, what did you say? I'm sorry. 21. 21. Um, <clears throat> isn't long, not even halfway through your watch before. Uh, same thing. Pam, 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 pam. And, and Ruin, you kind of look around to where the source is, and you see these two little eyes peering at you from the darkness. Just out of the darkness, they almost they almost seem to glow. Uh, and dark amber. vision for 120 feet. How can I make out any other shape? You make out a vaguely small humanoid shape, but they are very there. It's not just the shadows. It's also the underbrush. Uh, but you can you see like parts and pieces that you're like maybe vaguely humanoids on the smaller side. Could I take some of my rations to just kind of like chuck it in their direction? Just a little, little bit. Boop. Make a nature check. Ah, this will go well. Oh, that actually went well. Oh shit, that's at the end of one. Uh, 16. 16. Yeah. Um, what do you, what kind of rations do you have? What room? Peanut, please don't get too close to them. Oh, I'm not getting close. I'm just chucking it. Um, okay. I don't think it will tell you. Just like, do you think you have like dried uh, jerky or dried fruit or dried nuts? Dried food or... sustainable for extended travel, including jerky, dried food, hardtack, and nuts. Okay. Which, what type do you throw at them? Uh, it is a little bit of jerky. Just whoop. Jerky. So you hear like, so Ruin, you see the eyes back away. And you hear some rustling. It gets <laughs> actually. It misses, but it gets chucked at your head. <laughs> oh well, all right, not a meat eater. Uh, ooh, hey, whoop. dried fruit. Whoop. Make a persuasion check this time, at disadvantage. Huh? Two tens. Twelve. You hear some more rustling. Nothing gets chucked back at you. Well, they don't eat meat. So I, I, think we're, I think we're okay. The tech box is just kind of at will. Can I sense what the other one was feeling as it was eating the fruit? Um... I'll say since detect thoughts is how long does detect thoughts last? Last for a minute. Last for a minute. You would have to cast it again, but if you cast it again, every time you see like a glimpse of them, you get like brief flashes. Yeah. True. You you get brief flashes, and you hear uh, a sort of a fem feminine voice, and they're different voices every time. It's intruders. Tell the mother. Intruders. So I fire. actually hear voices this time instead of just feeling thoughts yeah you actually hear voices and it's it's just brief flashes every time you might catch a glimpse and it's usually the same thing uh intruders should we kill mother no fire bad keep watch i want to kill i don't hear any but i'm chucking another dry fruit just yep ah what? Some more rustling, and this this time you actually hear a little bit a little bit of um, like a few whispering, as as if as if you th it almost sounds like two things are fighting over it, <laughs> <laughs> or squabbling. Not really fighting, but just like, oh, it's my, my. you hear a very tiny people's elbow. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna just randomly just start chucking them into where I hear the the rustling and scrapping. Yeah. You, and you, you do start start to hear now they now that they know you know they're there. <laughs> you do hear the less stealthy, and you they're everywhere. They are 
they surround you on all sides. They're in the limbs and the branches. Just so peanut. Yeah. Hello. They definitely report to someone. Oh. Um. Is it the fire? Is... Fire will be our biggest advantage. Yeah. Uh. Well, about that. So, like, claps the tanker that he's sitting against. You know, this made of wood. That birds. Gonna point over at one of the trees. That guy birds. And if they bird, as soon as you say that, we bird. No way. As soon as you, as you, soon as you point the tree, and you say it burns, you hear in your head the very old emotional thing get very angry. <laughs> and see, we don't. Hey. No, I'm just saying that if we try to do fire, then that thing catches fire, everything else catches Whoa. fire, and it's awful. And I don't want to be stuck in the middle of that. The fire, the worse no, it no, gets. no, no, no. <laughs> Peanut, stop talking. Why? Because they're protective of their trees. Well, no shit. No, I, stop talking. They're protective of their trees. This is their forest. Anytime you make a comment about their trees, burning. It makes them very mad, and I can feel it. I can hear it. Okay. We're not here to harm their trees. Wait, hold on. So you, you can understand them? Yes, I can hear them. Okay, hang on. Let me try something. We're gonna put no. the fire out. No, we're not. So it's nice and dark. No. No danger. very happy sensation ruin and weirdly for the first time no malice so can I still see them running around yeah you you see pinpricks of eyes in the brush every now and then you see them running around and every time you catch a glimpse of one after he says that it's a fire maybe mother was could we what no. what what do, you, what, do you, what do you hear? Yes. Report. Very, very weary about putting out the fire. I do not know their intent, Tina. Can, can I make an insight check? No, I'm not not lying. Mm. You can if you want to. Insight uh, check. Uh, ruin, okay. make a per deception or uh, uh, <laughs> persuasion. I don't think she, he's going to need it. <laughs> uh, that's a five. <laughs> I, my persuasion is... Uh, expertise. It's a fucking 19. Okay, yeah, you I'm... believe her. <laughs> Him. Him. Sorry. <clears throat> okay. Rookie mistake. <laughs> if do, there's do, some... Do I see anything? Because, like, you know, the tree is, like, at this point, At this point, they have <laughs> stopped trying to avoid detection because they know they've been detected. So now they're letting you know how many there are. And yeah, you even you see like a brief flash, maybe a two two or three Peanut. eyes in the dark every now and then. I was meaning more when Peanut mentioned it of putting the fire out. Was there any sort of tell? Um and then all that rune yell at me. You might have heard like a little bit of rustling in the leaves, which is different. And a different, not like rustling in the undergrowth, like something's moving in there, almost like the trees themselves were moving the branches. And it was very different than the groaning and moaning and crunching that you were hearing before. Tina. Yeah. You've been feeding them, for lack of a better term. Yeah. And you are more of their size than wow. what we can gather. Wow. I just mean more relatable. Than True. me, who's taller and looping. Could you maybe ask one if they would come out and talk to us? If there's no harm. Yeah, sure. Okay. Uh, he stands up, grabs a handful of his dried fruits, walk like five feet from the fire so it's at my back, and just fucking plop down, just like toss it out. Go, Hey, can you understand me? Any, any one of you? So you're ten feet. Away, so you're near the underbrush now, and you have you have yeah, the just like three or four hand. feet away from the bush. I'm just kind of like, <laughs> just throw it in there. 
She's gonna, like, <laughs> it's one of the grab him. Yeah, you're gonna. What'd you, what you say your passive perception was again? <laughs> Twelve. <laughs> Twelve. You're gonna get uh, smashed. Ruins, what's yours? Passive perception. Mm-hmm. Uh, thirteen. Thirteen. Okay. Just what uh, I asked you, the question. You, you toss a few of the fruit out, and then you reach down to grab the fruit again, and your hand is empty when it should not be empty. You look down. It's gone. <laughs> oh. So what, I don't get to talk to anybody? It's, you just gotta take a... Okay, well... I will say make... You want me to put the fire those out? two things, make a, <laughs> no. make a persuasion check. Who? Peanut. I'll, I'll say with those two things, you can even do advantage. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I rolled oh. one of the two. You <laughs> know uh, Persuasions plus two, so that gets me a four. No response. And I, I walk try. up to Peanut and I stand behind him. If we can talk to someone, we could potentially put the fire out. I understand that you no, it's harmful for your trees. We're not here to intrude or burn anything. We just need to get through the forest. <laughs> At this Speak point, yourself. you have now both walked away from the fire and are facing away from it, and you both hear a scuffle, a scuff of dirt, and tss, as the fire goes out. Oh. Well, that solves that problem. You turn around. And there, standing in the clearing next to the fire, is a vaguely humanoid shape, probably somewhere... Aerodol, how tall are you? Um, oh, God. Uh, well, let me double check. I think I'm like three foot tall. Uh, uh, Peanut, how tall are you? Uh, Aerodol's taller than I am. Uh, three feet tall, but that doesn't include my ears. Okay. You, you see a form that's probably... four foot... Nine, four foot ten. So, close to siren. Yeah, close to siren. Close to like. Actually, it might even not be that. Hold on. Cause... Wait, you're only four foot tall. Siren's five foot two. Oh, okay. So yeah, a little bit shorter than siren. What roughly the height you might think of a thirteen year old human? Kind of gangly. Seems uh, some from what you can tell, seems to be wearing clothing of some sort, and just those. Has long hair. Uh, what the that fuck you you're talking about? Peanut can't see shit. <laughs> I can. Uh, and <laughs> Peanut, what you can see is there are a few things of moonlight and starlight coming through. So you do see a vague outline. And you just see bright auburn eyes. And you notice some of the eyes are auburn. Some of them are almost yellow. Some of them are silver. Uh, some of them are green. Some of them are deep red. Uh, they have a kind of a smattering of different colors of their eyes, but this one's Auburn. Peanut's just going, well, that solves that problem. Are you going to talk to us? No fire. The mother will decide. And she disappears into the darkness. Wait, like to uh, tonight? Oh. Well, do... No, you go ahead. Are there, are the trees, for, for lack of better term, mm -hmm. like, unmarked or, I, I guess I'm looking for potentially thieves can't carve into the trees. No, these trees are completely oh. bare, pristine. Yeah, they they are. Well, uh, an old it is an old untouched forest as for, a, a humanoid species has not left their mark in any way that you can tell okay well they took my berries fire's out I'm just gonna yes. like wander over to my tankard and sit down and can put I... my back to it <laughs> can I help him back okay what you don't want to watch Peter walk into a tree a good I don't want you to get snatched, Peanut. Oh, people can't steal V. Yes, Peanut. No, Peanut. <laughs> get 
in your tankard. Go to okay. bed. What? My watch isn't over yet, is it? Uh, right about now, you figure... Eh, that took a while. Watch might be closing. Gonna crawl in my tankard, find that rock, throw it at Aridol. Okay, make it... Make it no, no, I'm not. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm not serious about that. I'm keeping that rock. disadvantage. No, I'm keeping, I'm keeping that rock. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's his Ruin, temple. as you turn yeah. around, you... You just see lots of eyes in the darkness, and every now and then the pitter patter of feet. They don't seem to be encroaching anymore. They're just oh. watching. <laughs> Speaking of, hang on, I gotta kill the fire noise. Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> are there smoldering Most... embers still, or are they just quenched? They they just kick dirt on it until oh. it was out. Knock down our sandcastle. Um, so. You hear the sounds of the forest, birds, crickets, um, rustling of leaves. Hey, hey, forest hey, is actually strangely peaceful like this. Like, if this is how it's supposed to be. Rude, rude, rude. Yes, Peanut. What? Where, 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 where's Siren? To your left. Oh, yeah. Pitter patter over there. Wait, wait. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> He's gonna immediately just get up. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I deserve that, but it, it's your watch. You could have woken me up some other way. Oh, I'll think of other ways. <laughs> then you're not gonna get me to say what you want me to say. Give it time. Ties the fire out. Everybody. Oh, yeah. So I'm just gonna kind of like sweep in a general direction, probably hitting someone or something in the process. You uh, hit your mug. <laughs> <laughs> ah, my knuckles. <laughs> ah! Uh, so there's kind of a lot of little things out there. Uh, they were kind of bad that we had fire. So I put it out. And now the trees aren't angry anymore. So we just need to uh, not do fire. Okay. But they're they're not threatening, they're just watching, right? Yeah. Oh, they like berries. The bushes like really berries. like berries. Okay. The forest okay. provides, I give back. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna wake up Aridol and I guess we'll start our watch. Bah. I'm gonna totally not look where Aridol is because I can't see shit and just point at a bush and go, no fire. <laughs> I'm gonna grab Kina and just like gently turn him to face Aridol. No fire. <laughs> <laughs> What's really You're funny like... is on this live stream, you were actually pointed at Aridol and then turned away from him. <laughs> this is the best. I'm not gonna I forgot lie. my camera's you... not flipped when I'm in this thing. I was the wrong way. <laughs> You would have been able to see Aridol anyways. His eyes glow. <laughs> they are bright as yellow when they glow in the dark. <laughs> he can't see at night, but his eyes sure should still glow. <laughs> no fire. Eyes. Period. Why? Fire's good. Fire's no, because it upsets the forest. We don't want to upset the forest. Your trees. Hey, Siren. Could you point me at a tree real quick? Gently points him to a tree. If he starts fire, it's not our fault. Kill him, not me. <laughs> Please. Okay. Good talk. Now where's my mug? <laughs> Gently places him in the mug. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> Sorry, it's gonna look to air it all. You can hear well, right? Oh yes, I'm. I'm, oh, I'm pretty good at hearing. Okay, between Let me, let me your make sure hearing... I'm good at hearing real quick. Um, <laughs> not as good as Zahn, but it's okay. <laughs> okay. Compared to your hearing and my dark vision, we should be okay. Just enjoy the sounds and listen. <sighs> Once, wait, do you have a staff or is it an instrument? Wait a minute. I made a stick. Can you give me a stick? Hesitantly hands him a stick from the ground. <clears throat> Touches the top and casts light on it, and then sticks it in the ground. Immediate <laughs> rustling of of bushes. Okay, maybe no light. It's 
Strangely what? enough, no angry creaking. Forest is still somewhat. Of, it. The light is a compromise. It seems it is willing to abide by, but there's no heat, no burning, no crackling of fire. So it's like. Mm. Okay, maybe maybe this will be okay. Touche. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> don't take shit from things, especially trees. I'm trying to be nice to the trees because they, they can easily just boom. I never <laughs> said I was being mean to the trees. I just said I don't take shit from the trees. Just the whole ass tree. Just... Behave. Big ass water. From Harry Potter. <laughs> Instead of one branch, so it's the whole tree. Just like. <laughs> 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 yeah. Yeah. <laughs> also, trees don't talk. Yes, but they can still feel things. Things that are living, be it a plant or not, can probably still feel things. Hmm. Especially the magical one. <laughs> I feel like magical ones might be able to feel it more. Don't know probably. Why. <laughs> so, hmm. Okay, what do we do? I want to do stuff. I'm up. Um... Mm -hmm. Well, first off, perception checks, or oh, one yeah. gets advantage. Wow, you're not kidding. We have a lot of 20s tonight. 20. All right. Okay, we'll go off of him. <laughs> you don't have... Fuck it. <laughs> you two don't have a night sky to really look at. Every now and then you might get a peek at stars through the tree branches. But what is equally uh, starry is the underbrush, as while they seem to have gone back a little ways uh, from previously... Now that there is a light source, there's still just bunches of pinpricks of eyes in the bushes, like a starry night horizontal. <laughs> Those must be the ones that they were talking about watching us. Aerodol just be like, don't. watching you. Okay, you can watch, I... just don't do anything. Listen, I will try not to burn anything, just behave. Please, behave. behave, please. I, I will give you some of my gems that I have if you don't start anything. Aerodol is now uncomfortably close to you. <laughs> <laughs> you can't have them until it's morning and nothing has been started. I... <laughs> <laughs> Simon's going to look at the, the pinpricks and like, I wonder if they like music at all, or if they've ever heard music. Wait a minute. I have an idea. What is that idea? One second, I have to see if this would actually work. Uh... Be so happy Peanut's not awake for this. Uh... He has bagpipes. DM. Can I change the color of light with thaumaturgy? You can. Yeah, it says it right yes. in the description. I mean, with mm. light, you can change the color of light. Oh, I didn't know that. Well, thaumaturgy. Oh, the color can be colored as you like. No, no, yeah, I can do it anyway. I didn't know. It's I didn't read that far. Flames, though. Meh. Well, he can just change oh, the color right. with light. Yeah. <laughs> I Either will way. change the color to blue. Okay, it is now blue. As you as you uh, say you're going to play music since Boo is a color that travels less far. Play me music, and I want to hear the music. Okay. Please. <laughs> From by the way, that sounds familiar. Are you serious? I will I actually lost kick woods. you in the balls when you come down to. <laughs> 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 
You just pissed off all of our viewers. <laughs> yeah, especially me. I didn't even hear what this what it was. I'll give you a guess. We have a channel that fucking has something to do with it. <laughs> it it's, Zelda. No, it's, it's Zelda. Yeah, it's Zelda. Oh, okay. I've only played like two of those games. Uh, anyway. <laughs> As you play, you actually... Uh, if I would say, yeah, you're, you're, per, you're both perceptive enough. You actually see the trees start to slowly sway with, with, the, with the music. <laughs> the eyes just start going oompa loompa doopa dee doo <laughs> as she sees the, the tree swaying she's just gonna keep playing the gentle melodies to trying to appease yeah, the, the forest <laughs> that's kinda weird I've never seen trees dance this is why we behave shimmy shimmy <laughs> it's, not, it's not like super wiggly, but they're just slowly moving just a little. Bit. It's <clears throat> dancing nonetheless. There's something called slow dancing. Same thing. <laughs> in the dark. <laughs> what? Friends can't listen to Marvin Gaye in the dark? <laughs> <laughs> this forest is weird. Why is this forest weird, Siren? Well, no one else has ever really made its way in and out of it, so. Probably a good bet that um, there's some weird things going on in here. Erdol, as you say, it's weird. And based off everything else you've caused tonight, <laughs> you just feel a thunk in the side of the head. And you look down, there's an acorn that just drops to the ground. Siren's still playing. She's like, see? <laughs> just from the underbrush. <laughs> <laughs> Don't. Don't do it for the money. Yes, do I it can for the do gemstones. It. Okay. That counts as something. He forfeits. <laughs> he lost one gemstone. <laughs> what? No. <laughs> I will burn this place to the ground if I don't get those. <laughs> the tree stops waiting. It's, it's, shush your mouth, please. Thank oh, you. I was half expecting like a minigun of acorns just. <laughs> so I was still just going to keep playing gentle melodies for as long as she can. After <laughs> after a while, and if uh, <laughs> if Eridol doesn't say anything else, the trees do start to slowly shake again. Eridol doesn't say trees don't have eyes, do they? <laughs> ah! No, but there are other things in the forest that do have eyes. I'm not flipping those things off. I'm flipping the trees off. <sighs> Don't. Mm, I regret taking watch with you. The girls can get up and sit alone. <laughs> Go to bed. <laughs> Wait till the end of his watch. Uh, as so, after an hour, a uh, few hours pass, and you're playing your music, eventually you feel a uh, light hit your eyes uh, from somewhere through the trees. And you're like, oh, it has gotten brighter. It is now dawn. Siren's going to stop playing. You just like gently wake everyone up. Ah, the music stopped. What are you all doing? Well, we're all still alive. You just see fists appear out of the mug. <laughs> Apparently, the forest likes music. <laughs> you see coming out like, told you. <laughs> <laughs> now we're just doing uh, little toe beans doing finger guns. <laughs> <laughs> so, what happened to the FIRE? Uh, happened during Peanut and Rune's watch, but it's kind of a good thing because yeah. the F I R E was pissing off the forest. Yeah. No, um. no more, no more campfires. Only like, I don't know. Looking only at like this. what Aerodol did with the light orb thing. I just start using my thieves' tools as fucking knitting tools to change my spells up again. Okay. Uh, swap out bonfire with light. All right. Anything else? Oh, let's hit the oh, road, Jack. Right now. 
How dark? Uh, it's like that. Have you ever been up really early in the morning, and there's like that bluish tint of like that light blue uh, uh, in the air? <laughs> it feels a little like you feel well rested. So you're like, it's probably a little bit later in the morning than it appears to be. It's just the uh, trees and the and the forest itself blocking most of the light. Or perhaps it was our bard's ability for Saga rest. That was another reason why I was doing it. <laughs> sure as shit wasn't me. Let's go. Super yeah, I'm nice. sure you have great help. Hold on, let me I use said it chair. wasn't me. No, I didn't help. <laughs> what, Siren? Nah. Siren's going to gently hand over three gemstones to Eridol for behaving. What? We're gonna run out of gemstones, and oh, he's just gonna be I, minus. I am taking watch with Siren next. <laughs> Fuck, we're Pavloving our dragon to behave with gemstones. <laughs> How to train your dragon? <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather the trees to start just whacking us like hammers? <laughs> I'd I'd be okay with one of us. <laughs> There's so many good possible titles for tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Eridol hugs his gems. Gives one a lick. Tastes nah. like raisins. Tongue is long. It's like a six inch long, like... <laughs> it's a long leg. <laughs> yeah. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> How fucking rude space. He's like, oh, really? <laughs> yes, yeah, so he has a long serpentine tongue. Uh. Right. Does well. anybody uh, does anybody have any extra like clothes or cloth I could borrow? For what? Well, the rope was kind of digging into my shoulders a bit. I was told oh. I can't be naked. That's why I said extra. Let's see. <laughs> uh, can I? I don't like that Ruth's giggling at me. <laughs> yes, so no. much. I, I I just like take off my tunic or drape that covers my shame. My shame being my pecs. But. You have her. I'll be honest. I was kind of always imagining you wearing like Aladdin's thing that it's like it was on his shoulders but did nothing. Yeah. <laughs> now he's Tarzaning it. Wow. Oh. It is ripped. Well, thank you, Albeck. <clears throat> I needed that. Uh, Got oh, it. okay. Oh, what's, what's wrong, Eddie? No, I was going to offer to kind of make it into padding on it, but if he needs it back, then we'll have to find some other cloth. I was going to say we could liberate something from the surroundings, but I've got to go with yep. a no on that one. Eridol's going to reach into his bag and pull out one of the fucking wolf pelts he still has. Oh, hey, that'll do. And, and <laughs> hand it over. <laughs> Odie, thank you. Hey. Yeah. Oh, uh, can sorry. All back. Thank you. <laughs> Raw go. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> yep. Can yep. I use my leatherworking tools to cut out two roughly shoulder strap size strips? Yeah, to it, kind it of doesn't need to be his... pretty. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Make a make a tools check. Oh, we're tools, all right. <laughs> uh, dexterity plus proficiency, right? I didn't hear a single no. <laughs> uh, that'll be a thirteen. Thirteen? Yeah, you're able to. It's it's definitely not pretty, but it's functional. All right. Can I affix it to the yeah. straps? I'll I'll cool. count that all in one. Yeah. <laughs> All right, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> so, you know, kind of important question. Um, what fucking way are we going? Who wants to East. make a survival check? I like how Olmec lifted his arm and the camera me is like, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the 18. 20 not natural alright once again the bird and the cat 
now that I think about it, it's kind of weird. Uh, look around, assess <laughs> the situation, and go both of them at the same time. That way! Wow, you guys are really good at direction. <laughs> that way? God, I go whichever way I go. And you're going this way. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Aerodol is sitting there playing with two of the gems in his hands because he is now two gems richer. He's just click clack rocking them. Yes. My pile <laughs> grows. Shiny rocks make the click clack noise. <laughs> Listen, just because I want to sleep on a pile of gold doesn't mean that I'm crazy. She doesn't want to sleep on a pile of gold. For no reason. Crazy. At all. This way. <laughs> and I start walking. All right. You all pack up and head out. Trudging into the forest. Um... <laughs> I can't remember, does Olmec or Siren or Ruin have the highest passive perception? I believe it's Olmec. It is not me. Mine is 15. 15? 13. 13. Olmec. Okay. You being completely, well, not completely oblivious, but mostly oblivious to the uh, to the Don't. events of last night, uh, definitely notice you're being followed. A lot. On all sides. <laughs> and above you. <laughs> That's what I'm all sides used. means. I'm used to this feeling. What feeling? Yes. We are being followed. Are you being Probably the children in the forest. <laughs> Peanut's gonna whip around like, where? <laughs> the <laughs> no. It's just, ooh. <laughs> Momentum 360s him. <laughs> uh, <laughs> who, who thinks it would be closest to him? Not me. Probably no, Siren. Probably She's going to get knocked in the hip. Uh, Odie's Siren always my side. And uh, Odie, make a dexterity check. Ah, oh, fuck. Dexterity <laughs> safe? Yeah, safe. Oh, nat 20. Let's go. <laughs> you, you being kind of used to this, you just kind of uh -oh. hip thrust out of the way. Siren? Uh -oh. I got a three. You got a three? You are immediately like bowled over, just wham, face first into the ground. <laughs> Where? Oh. It, hits, it hits your hips and basically runs you over. <laughs> what? what are you doing this down there? Wow. <laughs> what are you doing down there? Ow. I pick up Siren from the dirt by her shoulders. <laughs> Just sit her up. <laughs> I'm not going to stand by Peanut there. anymore. <laughs> That's probably wise. Aw. It's okay, I'm still here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It hits the fucking mug, but ting! <laughs> <laughs> we are not turning my mug into a spittoon. Out the fire. Uh, it's funny. Do Can I cast the tech thoughts again? Just. Uh, yeah. Really, really. You cast the tech thoughts. Uh, you'll have to cast. I mean, you'll have to make a perception check to see if you can find any of the um, humanoids. But you just you get you get the general. The forest I'm seems to be in a lot better sure. mood than you left it, and you're assuming that's because you woke up to Siren playing music. Thirteen. Thirteen? No. No. Uh, you can hear them. Nothing. Is you the can hear them. thoughts like a radius, or is it a like targeted thing? It can be both, but you have to be able to see. I have to be able to see. Yeah. Oh. Don't look at Peanut. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Slippery Same. thoughts, anyway. Yeah, there, there's music playing. There's sadness about not being paid for to go for the watch last night. It's a mess. <laughs> you should, you should look at Aerodol. La 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 gold. La la la. la. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to read Peanut's thoughts, and you just see the painting of the dogs playing poker. <laughs> oh, I'm not reading any of their thoughts. Mm -mm. Okay. Mm -mm. Peanut um, is the epitome of intrusive thoughts. <laughs> My mind is an enigma. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, you're, you aren't able to catch a glimpse. You can hear them pitter-pattering around, but no glimpses. Pitter-patter, they skedatter. Do I hear any laughing other than the usual laughing that I hear every now and then? No laughing. None, none more than usual. Hmm. <laughs> Who has the map? Odie. Ah. How uh, how many days we got this forest? I don't think it tells us well, by the day. I mean, I 
also know how to read a map, Aridal. Oh. Uh, you looking uh, at it? Two, three max, depending on how good of a time you make. Probably be all right. Maybe two, three days. That's not too bad. Four, th four if you get lost at some point. <laughs> <laughs> With these two, hell no. <laughs> Just, just had we to... both point different directions. We're just like, wait a minute, <laughs> recalibrate. <laughs> um, you get about halfway through your day of travel. I'm hungry. And then... Have a snack. Odie and Olmec. Mm -hmm. You notice that... You've definitely passed that, that rock, that boulder before. And that tree. God damn it. I'm gonna uh, cast Dancing. Mm. I'm gonna cast Dancing Lights. And okay, the sun is up. You're able to see now. Like, yeah, I know. It's a, it's a little dim in the forest. I know. But you're able to see. I know. Okay. I'm casting Dancing Lights to use it as a marker. Okay. You cast Dancing Lights. And you're you're making it stay still in this one spot. Yeah, I have four orbs, so I'm gonna have one stay there, and I'm gonna have the other three follow me. Okay. Go. Keep you keep walking. You're like I, I know I know it's this way. We're going the right way. Keep walking, keep walking. Yeah. About an hour later. Oh look, a dancing light. Hmm. We there yet? I and you all see this happen now. <laughs> Why, why aren't gonna... you guys supposed to be really good at telling us where we're supposed to go? We were going the same fucking direction, and you see this dancing light here, and you think that this is our tracking's problem? Well, yeah. Is How there... else would it be here? We're the same direction, asshole. <laughs> is there a tree I can walk up to? There's trees everywhere, bud. <laughs> well, yeah, but what do I can, I can like, get forest? to? <laughs> yeah. I mean, there's at this point, there's one directly next to you. <laughs> Just got to look over go. Hey, hey, buddy. What the fuck? <laughs> Can we... I mean, we put the fire out. We were good boys and girls, except Aridol. Can you keep him here and let us go? Fuck you! Case in point, I put the fire out. Oh. Oh. Okay, hold on, time out. Styron, Was I the only one that heard the tree talk to me? It came from behind you. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> is I'm just oh gonna make my dexterity check. Fucking, <laughs> I got a natural one. <laughs> natural one. Oh. Same thing that happened to Siren. <laughs> 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 this one, Buddy. unlike Siren, you were taken out at the knees. <laughs> <laughs> I get swept and. <laughs> Honey, let me let me help you up. Oh, no. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> so you all turn around. Uh, to a figure that two of you saw last night, but now can see their features. Um, it is. It looks like a younger humanoid female, uh, but at the same time, not. It, in a weird way, they look feminine in some ways, like the general shape of their body. The face is sort of androgynous <laughs> with a little bit of it leaning towards femi femi feminine, but not quite a little strange to look at almost like uh not quite uncanny valley but very close uh almost like a mask not really a, not really a mask just like certain features are more mute where you would expect certain types of features Ariel spins around claws drawn and <laughs> Aaron <I'll laughs> cut that shit out why are you so aggressive uh, she has long auburn hair, uh, the same slightly glowing auburn eyes that you saw before, uh, slightly pointed ears, and a tunic made out of various undergrowth, a little bit of maybe branch and bark, but mostly leaves and vines of varying shapes and sizes. Some of the leaves are very big, some are very small, all seem to be held together uh, by some unknown force. Oh, hi. Magic bra. But she looks roughly the about 
the size and age of like a 13 year old human so uh hi why why are we stuck because the mother deems it so well can the mother deem it uh, like more that direction she might she might not Uh, is there any way we could uh, convince her or even know what she wants from us we're just trying to pass respectfully through the forest as much as we can now that we know you don't like fire now that we know you don't like fire we're not going to use fire Last night, please. Last night did some send some very mixed messages. Yeah, that's us in a nutshell. At this point, you hear some more creaking and rustling. At this point, you notice they have all stepped into view, and they have (coughs) all bows drawn in the tree. There's at least twenty to thirty young women of varying heights and ages you fit you probably clock the oldest at somewhere between 16 or 18 looking and the youngest as young as 10 maybe um we're in all danger various shades of blonde green auburn um hair colors eye colors some are very pale uh, almost almost uh paper white some are very tan uh, almost uh, like uh, I would say Donald Latino, Trump. Uh, like almost the Latino Ow. spectrum. Which one of you took my berries? <laughs> Why you, see, you look around, you see one crack a smile. <laughs> 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 yeah. They have red, just they have their cheeks. You stuff, are just... very unobservant. Yeah, no, I'll give you that. <laughs> yeah, that's peanut. Yep, nailed it. Well, I'm, I'm mean... just with the mug and everything. I'm just kind of. Poof, and just like plop down, just sit. I'm not walking he until lands he on my toe. <laughs> yeah, he can crush his toe with the mug. <laughs> well, again, we mean you no harm coming through here. We were just trying to get to what the Evermore. Oh no, we were trying to get to. Uh, give me a minute. Um, we're trying to get the river boot. What river boot? I gotta I've get. I've never my... heard that. Yeah, I gotta get the giant killing weapon. Right? Right. Mm-hmm. We know of the river moot. They, like uh, Xantharls, keep out of our woods. What makes you think you're so special? Well, for starters, we're not one of them. I mean, I'm technically not even from here. Like, it's plane of existence. Or yeah. It's plane. Mm-hmm. And I mean, to we're be not... f- fair, we're not special either. Yeah, I mean, we're... <laughs> All right, he's a little special. <laughs> but... I'm just laughing at you. Uh, I mean, yeah, we're not from around here. We're just trying to pass through. I mean, we meant no disrespect by it, and uh, we'll abide by your rules if you'll grant us passage. Personally, I think we should... Just turn you all into pin cushions. Maybe take one or two of you as a slave. But I will. that is not up to me. Come along. As she turns and walks into the uh, forest in a different direction. So why do they all look so young? Because they're young. Shut up, old man. <laughs> you hear, you hear uh, her call behind her towards you. We are the Dryads. Do not judge our appearance as our age. Well, I'm the same Sorry. kind of, so, you know. Sorry, what'd eh. you say? Let's just, let's not make waves, let's just go and listen. <laughs> I was gonna say yeah. something really smart-ass, but nope, I'm just tired of walking. Well, we have to walk more. Hey, you, pretty lady, think you said you were dry, do you have a name, or do we just call you Dryad? Peanut's like if you jogging if you to survive like... to if you survive to the end of the day, I'll give you my name. All right, fair deal. I'll take it. I'm gonna look up at Rune with this just look of like, I'm not dying in this forest. If I'm <laughs> dying, I'm taking it with me. <laughs> you will behave. 
Hey, so, uh, pretty lady dryad person, you, like, just s sort of start to spin, but not quite fully spin. It's like just this little area, or is it like the whole wood that you do? The lurk wood is our domain. Holy shit. There are shit. other pockets of dryads in the high forests and other woodland realms. So if we get permission to pass through, we're not going to run into more that are going to be just as bad, but that we're here. She laughs, and the laugh you hear is almost like the ringing of, of silver bells. It's a very nice laugh. If you pass through and are granted passage, I'll guide you out myself. Haha, <laughs> cool. I have a bet to win, too. Told the guy that we totally make it through here without dying. Why would you yep. Come? I would have bet <laughs> against you as well. Uh-huh. Mm. Well. At this time... <laughs> I'm gonna point at Siren. What? What? I'll cast a message. Okay. PETA will totally distract everyone. <laughs> Trying to word it correctly. This group... Do I have a word limit? For message? Mm -hmm. uh, I don't believe so. No, that's sending has a 25 word limit. I read it. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> this group... Is interesting. Mm -hmm. And our party is obnoxious. Mm hmm. We're not going to get through this forest if we don't respect trees. No da. Oh. Be average. Hey, pretty lady dryad. Wait. Oh, sorry, I thought you were dead. I'll wait. No, no. I mean, you can talk. No, no, finish uh, your message. I'm curious. We have to impress them somehow. We have to piss them off. <laughs> <laughs> Step one. <laughs> How do we impress uh, you can them? You can reply in a whisper that only I can hear. Yes. You listen, yeah, reply to the Lorax. Mishi pee pee. Quick, someone speak Simlish. Ush noof norf. It's a bloopy nor. It's a bloopy nor. Marsha nay. Marsha nay. Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. Kind of curious. So what is this mom person? Like, is she a tree? The mother is our matron of the dryads. Every forest has one. So she's a person thingy. She is a conduit for the entire forest. Does she take on a form and appearance, or? Oh yes. Okay. I believe some of I believe some of you and she she kind of pointedly looks at the males will find her quite pleasing to the eye. They usually all do. Is she a dragon? <laughs> no. Why would she no, be a dragon? I don't know if she's ever wanted to take on that form. Well wait, hold on a second. She can take on the form of a dragon and have a conversation. She we might need try. to be respectful. I would never be disrespectful to another dragon. Then keep your mouth shut. Uh, speaking of which, so I kind of found some wood in my mug and I was kind of using it to try to patch it up. If it's just already on the ground, is, is, is that okay? I don't, and like Peanut is like, as he's saying this, as he's passing a tree, just kind of like stops and just follows, not stops, but like rotates to follow it with his eyes. Like, I don't want to piss <laughs> off any of these 
As he talks, Lovely. Odie's eyes just kind of widen, just like, <laughs> I carved the fuck out of that log. <laughs> you and I it. thought, that, was good. that log had a child. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so, I don't, I mean, I'd be happy to wait until I'm out of, out of your forest, but if there's just, say, like, a log that's already kind of there. I don't want to make you mad at me. She kind of just doesn't say anything and lets the and lets the uncomfortability prolong. Oh shit! She's <laughs> mad at me. No, she's <laughs> mad at you, Odie. It's your fault. <laughs> and you guys said I was going to be the one to get us in trouble. <laughs> and then she I, laughs again. I dispel my woodcarver's tools. I didn't do shit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look at that tree. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're magical. I just <laughs> oh, <laughs> she uh, laughs again. That like silvery bell laughter. Even we use the bounties of the forest. How else would we devise our crafts? The forest what? provides. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Erdal's really freaked out that everybody just said this at the same time. He's really <laughs> clueless. <laughs> How, how, planar weird. how far are we from our destination? If I may ask. She stops, turns around. We're there. And you look around and you have entered a clearing where the trees themselves have shaped into staircases. And you look up and the branches and limbs of the tree have formed into huts and houses up in the limbs. Oh, and little, cool. little flickering lights dance uh, along the limbs as a light source, well, Bright, brightening the wasn't... sorry, brightening our, the already dim forest to a very nice level of light. Well, I'd be lying if I said it wasn't quite impressive. Hmm. I wanted to say something, but I'm not. I'll save it for later. Um, out of one of the huts, one of the larger ones comes a humanoid seemingly adult female woman <clears throat> she's very voluptuous has a long gown of different colored um, autumn leaves yellows oranges uh, reds uh, seemingly coming together in a nice uh, gown that kind of gently flows along the ground as well uh, on she has different jewelry made of vines and flowers along her neck and up and down her arms. Uh, the dress is sleeveless. Um, and on her brow rests a crown of autumn leaves and flowers. It, is, that, is that her? This is the mother, yes. Is there any customary notes we should know to be respectful? Don't use the F word. Not fuck Which the one? other one. I should. <laughs> I would bow. Siren is well already said. bowing in respect. I'll, I'll give a bow. <laughs> DM, I need a ruling. One behind me. DM, I need a ruling. <laughs> Make a strength check. Well, I was going to say, if, if, if Peanut bows, does everything come out? I want to see if you fall over. Rune has a very polite, sophisticated, trained bow. Oh, no. Well, that was a one and a three. So uh, that's six. Peanut, you try to bow, and as everything starts to spill out, you tip over, just <laughs> and, and everything falls on top of your head. <laughs> I'll clean uh, that up. Oh, I, I need to set it up. Just start like. <laughs> <laughs> so this woman walks up to you all in this clearing. She's she has the same sort of features that uh, feminine yet androgynous, but hers definitely do lean more toward feminine than a lot of the others. Uh, very beautiful, very... You You almost feel she is, she is somehow spring and autumn personified in a way. 
she wow. gives this air of dignity and yet exu- uh, youth and vitality. You'd be a very pretty dragon. Hmm. A dragon. Yes. Not a form I've ever taken before. They said the same thing, too. Well, the other ladies. My daughters? Yes. Yes. So. Six travelers. Walking through a woods that they have no business being in. And yet, when I consult the stars and the winds, I am told to have patience and discerning. Oh, you're going to need a lot of patience with us. Some more than others. We'll try and be respectful. Why should I let you live? We're pretty cool. I gave your daughter's berries. Wait, is can, can I look around? So can I see funny. the one that's smiling? <laughs> <laughs> She's lost into the crowd, and you now notice uh, there, what once was a party of 30 following you is now hundreds in the in the canopy Ooh. and uh, the surrounding area. There are more <clears throat> than you can count. I'm just going to pick one at random and go, that one. While it is always good to give back to nature what you took from it, that does not excuse your trespassing. Uh, uh, We're just trying to, again, we're just trying to pass through respectfully. We're not trying to impede. We're just trying to get to our destination. And I apologize if we're trespassing. We'd happily get out. I didn't know that this was a no-passing zone. Rune. May we have your permission to pass through? You see a, 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 a slight smile crack on her face. It's a little late. Well, to be fair, we didn't know you existed. And if we did, we didn't real quite know how to contact you. Also, you don't exactly have a calling card. We, we asked no, the I'm... dudes at Xanthar's and they said that people just went in and did come out. I thought they were just stupid and got eaten. We didn't, mm-hmm. we didn't, we didn't know that, uh, you lovely people have, I mean, your forest is fucking gore. I'm like, that house, I kind of want one. Another, uh, another slight smile cracks on her face. Well, while we do allow the dire wolves to consume some of the travelers that come through here. Oh, big puppies. Others Penis are... Just like... <laughs> others are struck down by our bows, and others are put to use that sounds ominous lurks for hire (laughs) Um, (laughs) is there anything you'd lack in return for safe passage a sort of tribute if we must she kind of tilts her head as if not expecting this suggestion tribute see it on the stream (laughs) though What what he said, what he said, (laughs) that one. (laughs) Hmm. You know, in the old days, back when our forests were more respected. Sorry. back Back when your kind did not find themselves so enthralled by their roads and their cities. The ways to contact us and ask for permission were known. I mean, I kind of prefer rivers myself, but... Meh. I'm not from here. I, I, <laughs> if, you'd, if you'd be willing to teach us, we'd be happy to use that in the future to contact you and, you know, be respectful about it. As part of this suggested tribute... You will also take this knowledge to those bordering our woods. Gladly, we'll. I mean, I gotta go back to Xanthar's Keep anyway to get my cl- my bet claimed, so that'll be awesome. We'll blast as out a notice she, to every she, town in the area. She actually walks forward, Odie, as you have been doing the majority of the talking, and she just like slightly brushes a hand down your face. <laughs> <laughs> you will, you will. <laughs> 
You are of the Fey races. You are known to us. He kind of drops his form and just becomes his normal changeling self. If we were further into spring, I might make use of you. Oh. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> what kind of use we talking about? I always need more daughters. Peanut's just bow, chicka, bow, wow, bow, chicka, bow, wow. Well, but it's not flattered. Quite, not quite in season. If it was, I would have killed the females and just taken a few of the more delectable males. Peanut bristles Siren's a little bit. Siren's just gonna inch behind Olmec. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this, this is probably the first time that Peanut's like bristled slightly. Mm-mm. She looks down at you. Worry not, little one. The winds and the stars vouch for you. Though why, I have yet to discern. Uh, Tell me if you're well, a dragon. Huh. I suppose we should tell you our business, if that helps you discern, or helps your judgment at all. We're kind of fighting giants. I don't know if they're a th- of threat to your forest, but we're actually headed to get a giant slain weapon to protect everything, really. <laughs> except the just giants. His mug. I want to complete my collection. Yes, I have heard the rumblings. And some have ventured into our forest, driven back so far, yet I get the feeling <laughs> they will return with more. Something is wrong with the ordning. Something that has not happened since the days of old. The back what? when I was yet a seedling. The what, what? You've the aged well. The Ordening? It's the hierarchy of the giants. Something Ooh. seems to be amiss. So how long ago did that happen? Recently. Within the last few moons. Something, and how long did... Oops, sorry. Something has upset them. Upset the balance. So when did the Ordening thingy happen? Like I said, the past few moons, something oh, happened. Bad. Which uh, which way did the giants come in from? Some from the north, some from the south, and some from the west and oh, the east. God. They have so ventured on all sides. Would you Even be opposed to wiping them all out? one trying to find his way in from... Oh. Never mind. He's a friend. Oh, what? Sorry, you were saying. I mean, we were kind of heading to the east, so if there were some that way, I'm good for there a good There is one. Cake. He's in the f- friend one. He's headed north toward the Frost Hills. He's an old friend. I bear him no ill. Actually, I believe he even fathered a few daughters. Oh? Were they as big as him? <laughs> Do I see some waving from the crowd? Yes, me. <laughs> you see a you see a few uh not very many, but a few with white hair. Oh. Are they taller than everyone else? A little bit. They're 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 the ones that kind of uh seem to present as the older variety. So do you want to tell us what he looks like so we don't kill that one? My little friend, I'm not even sure you could. I would very much like to I did not that. build this thing. It'd be a shame for us to try them. <laughs> he is not quite... He is not equal to his brethren. Mm. He is far and above them. So he's taller than them. So you're saying there's a chance. The, I am saying that if you were to fight him, I would bring... I believe the mortals call it popcorn. Ah. Uh, a snack of champions. I would agree with this statement. Popcorn is fantastic. I make it with my... Um... Anyway, I, I, I draw. I drag a palm down Aerodol's face. 
Uh, well, I mean, is is there any tribute you had in mind? And should we get to learning this ritual? Anytime you or someone else would like to re-enter our forest, we are just at a basket on the boundaries. This can contain any number of tributary items of nature returning to nature. If accepted, the basket will be empty in one day. If rejected, the basket will remain full after one day. What, uh, what would cause a basket to be rejected? They don't like beef jerky. Anything that. not given with the ripest intent. Mm. I'm assuming that comes down even to the collection of said items. Like no ripping branches off trees, nothing. Ripping branches off trees would definitely result in, a, in very harsh consequences if we ever caught you within firing distance. I... <laughs> never doing it. I'm just saying that's kind of an example of a baddie. I'm not that... Yeah. Yeah, see, Rude over there is writing everything down so we could tell people so that they know not to be idiots. Right, Rude? Or are you doodling again? Because I value knowledge, Peanut. See? As we probably should right now. As for your tribute this time... What is your name as she looks at Odie? Uh... My true name is Odie Scallopin. Odie Scallopin. I require that you return to this forest at a springtime of your choosing before your death. Uh, I can make that happen. <laughs> You're gonna die. I, look, I got time. <laughs> and you are more than welcome to bring a few friends, as long as the rituals are observed. Will do. And we disseminate this info to all the other keeps, especially surrounding the forest. I expect to see travelers bearing tribute within the month. In the month, huh? Alright. Or at all. Dude. If I see any more travelers not bearing tribute, I shall hold you all accountable. And you better not and you better not enter my woods ever again. <sighs> as long as there are some bearing tribute though, I know the word will have spoken. Okay, if there are some true. who's if there are some who still choose to enter unabashed, well they know what happens. Aren't brazen hunters the worst? <laughs> yeah. Aren't direwolves so cute? Yeah, they are. Yes. Bobby. <laughs> they give the best kisses. Are we thinking of the same animal? Yeah, big fluffy things with teeth. They're good to wrestle. Not as good as bears. Now, seeing as the stars and winds have once again not turned me awry, and you've made at least a fair impression. Well, more well than you did last night. Okay. All right. She turns and opens her mouth, and instead of common or any other recognizable language, a strange cacophony of rustling branches, creaking wood, and <laughs> leaves on the wind... Uh, seems to <laughs> flow from her mouth. Not oh, unpleasant. Uh, sorry, I just picture her vomiting leaves. <laughs> <laughs> As she does this, a uh, a dryad. You see a dryad slowly walk away from the group, and then walk back in, and you see her holding a strange-looking quiver, uh, an arrow quiver made from wood. And vine. Can I cast detect language? 
or comprehend languages. Can you cal quickly? Can you cast it? Uh, is, it ins is it just an instantaneous? Does it say one action, I one minute? One action. One action. You catch the if you cast it, you catch the ending Tail half. End. Yeah. Um, you, it's you hear the noise and it slowly drifts into the quiver of our kind, please. Oh. Um, she presents this quiver, and you see there is a single arrow in this quiver. It may, this entire thing is carved out of wood, and a single long vine wraps around the entire thing and then attaches to the end of this arrow. Uh, the strap is uh, made from vine and bark. Uh, thank you. This is a tether vine quiver. Oh. That Who sounds is she interesting. presenting this to? She's just presenting it um, to the group. Would this be suitable for any member? I have a crossbow. I'd be itching to use it. It does work with any form of bow, bolt or arrow. Anyone else use bows? I have an axe. I have fingers. You're I looking at me know. like I'm stupid. Okay. <laughs> huh. Yeah. Whoever would like to use it. If you fire an if you fire the arrow and the as she plucks the uh, the vine, it does reattach to any arrow it uh, you choose and she reattaches it to the arrow. When you fire the arrow, the vine will go along with it depending on how much you have allowed to grow, up to, I believe, 120 feet. It can retract anything of a moderate size, nothing too heavy. Anything too heavy, and it will automatically let the arrow go. Or you can let it know that you want it to detach from the quiver itself and use it as a rope. Ooh. Ooh. So, Rude, you shoot stuff too, right? Yes. Hold the parchment shears for it. You two, ready to go. That's fine. <laughs> well, whoever wants it, I'm going to put the description into the group chat. Sorry, what's a group chat? This is outside <laughs> the game, you bastard. Uh, and I will work on getting a uh, item drawn up for that hey love there lady uh yes what what would a latide have to do to make that <laughs> to make this look look like one of those sort of are you pointing to your your big mug yeah or the, 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 the big i'm saying like can i make my big mug look pretty like houses she kind of lifts her hand and then tw uh, twists it, and you all see vines and roots sprout up from the ground and slowly encapsulate and fill in the gaps and cover and then bind uh, to this <laughs> mug. Thank you. Um, Bia's just going to, like, out. climb up inside and just, like, admire. <laughs> Well, I guess if that's all. Oh, oh, you are... hey, climbs up over there. Where, where's the one that was guiding them? No, uh, she's still standing over the side. And you look at her. And she's I... got kind of like a perplexed, almost like disappointed look on her face. We had a deal. Yes, we did. Very well, mother. I wait. Offered to guide them out if they succeeded in your discernment. Oh, not that. I wouldn't know your name. <sighs> Oak. Peanut. Cody. 
uh, and you notice you notice now that you kind of look at her. She her skin is roughly the tint of brown of oak and bark. Her hair is like the auburn color that a uh, oak leaf might uh, turn in the autumn time. And you kind of look around. And you notice like most of the women here probably match up in some way <laughs> to a tree, a very specific tree. I just cool. picture just Odie yelling out juniper and then like ten arms go. <laughs> <laughs> How many people have the same name here? We all have the same name in common. Oh. But it's a little different in our language. Oh. Okay, language is that? Of... Oh, sorry. Um, it's our own little version of Primordial. Interesting. Eric Dahl's ears perk up. They say offshoot dialect of Terran. Hmm. Oh. I'll have to read so, it. So if you could be any color dragon, what would you be? Are you asking this to the mother? Yeah. <laughs> Make a persuasion check. Sure. I'm very persuasive, apparently, but I don't think my persuasion is good in... <laughs> Oh no, my first waste is actually not shit. <laughs> oh, it's a dirty 20. <laughs> dirty 20? 16 plus She kind of gives you a look, uh, just a bemused look, and then kind of eyes to the corner as if thinking. And then the dress slowly starts to move as the leaves swirl up around her, cover her form, and then form into a long serpentine body of leaves and other vines and growth. Uh, and she actually takes on a very serpentine dragon form, very reminiscent of the ones you know, made of all different manner of leaf colors and uh, and a mane of roots, branches, and vines. I'll be back with him whenever that spring happens. No, the fuck you won't. All right. <laughs> <laughs> the leaf, it slowly settles down and the leaves fall and to reveal her cho her normal form again it's a good choice just make sure no fires next time and we'll see yeah. i'm sorry i'm a, by the way were these lights a no as well mm. i haven't seen those in quite a while then again it's been some time since anyone of magical teachings has been foolish enough to enter of their own accord <laughs> yeah, we're pretty dumb. Hey. I said we. Well, we did cost you <laughs> almost a day of travel. So. Mm. That's fine. We're not welcome. in a rush. You're welcome to board with us for the night. <gasps> Woo! And, Falls back in his mug. <laughs> and my daughter <laughs> shall guide you come morning. I was about to say, <laughs> okay, your daughter, but I think all of them are your daughters. So yeah, most of them, some of them have the makings of being mothers themselves, but are not quite aged enough. Hmm. Are they easy to tell? I'm not asking this in character. <laughs> you would, you would assume probably the ones that present a bit older looking might be but you're not sure well that'd be awful nice hey hey Olbeck hmm what's your favorite tree cherry blossom alright hands up <laughs> you actually don't see any cherry blossom hands oh Unfortunately, <laughs> dryads of that nature are not native to this region. Ah. Well, that's a shame. I like apple trees. A couple of hands go up. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Hi. Any we weeping willows? No? A few hands actually go up. Oh, hey, hey. Water's great. 
<laughs> Those are my daughters who keep an eye on the Evermore for me. Wait, the weeping willows or the apple trees? The willows. Why would an apple tree be watching fucking water? I'm sorry, Rune. I couldn't hear you over the sass. <laughs> it's coming out of your mouth. Sire, what about you? Stand you over the um, aspens. Got to remember what aspen those, those aspen the, looks like. Those are the light don't birch they have ones. A lot of, oh, I was gonna say, don't right? they have a lot of resorts there? That's birch, Ian. Birch, damn it. Yeah, it's birch. Oh, aspens yes. are also very light colored. Uh, mm -hmm. you do see a ha! few go up. <laughs> they are they are the ones that are almost like paper white, pale, but they all have dark freckles. And yellow hair. Rude, you're next. What? What what kind of tree favorite do you like? Tree do I like? Yeah. If I had a favorite tree, it'd be rude not to have a favorite tree. Come on, don't be rude. Yeah, don't be rude. At this point the matron is also <laughs> just kind of just watching very amused. <laughs> She's checking the ancient tabs of Goog. <laughs> what? What's that face? <laughs> Maple trees. A couple very similar looking to uh, Oak kind of raised their hand as well. Very auburn hair, darker skin. I was thinking earlier about Juniper. There are a few that raise their hand for for Juniper as well. Uh, so, not to, you know, change the subject or anything, what do you ladies eat out here other than fruit? And what do you do Berries? for fun when you're not being harassed by jackasses like us? Ouch. I'll be the boy. We didn't quite come in here on good graces. <laughs> Taking care of the forest is a full-time job. Well, I suppose so. It's nice to... I will say not all of us are active all at the same time. Some of us like to hibernate. Just have a little powwow by the fire. Stop it. <laughs> Down <Aerodals>. boy. <laughs> Even Aerodol's going to be like, you just sassed me? Old, <laughs> old habits die hard, sorry. <laughs> Not all of us need to be awake. So. Well, that. Um, not to be rude, but um, I am kind of really super hungry. Can I just go find something in the forest? We have rations. Yeah, I said super hungry, not I'm starving to death. Please feed me paper. <laughs> uh, more, more of this, of this, um, of this uh, primordial speech flows from uh, her as baskets woven out of vines and bark and other natural elements uh, are brought over filled to the brim with different berries, fruits, and nuts. Did Rune understand I love, it? I was about to say... <laughs> is it, you said it's offshoot of Primordial. So mm -hmm. who here speaks Primordial? Other than me, obviously. You... It is, it, is, it is similar to hearing Spanish spoken in the country that you didn't learn it from. You pick up a few words, but a lot of it's like that might have been this word, but I'm not sure. Hmm. Race car. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I can cast comprehend language again. I just didn't know if it was still active. How long does uh, it last? An hour. So yeah, it probably will last. Yeah, mostly, mostly just um, ladies, if you will, feed our guests. Aerodol's gonna guests, take Aerodol's gonna take two of them and just sit down with them. Bitch fan, I didn't mean need man, I guess. I just there start chomping on my stale jerky. Plenty of baskets. <laughs> hey Siren. Dude, yeah. dude, 
do do the thing, the plucky pluck. You could ask. Please. <laughs> There's a question mark at the end of that. <laughs> <laughs> I'd play the bagpipes, but I don't think they like Please, that. Please, <laughs> God, no! I mean, if you're not going to play music, I will gladly play something. <laughs> the last possible, well, the last potential man that tried to woo me with bagpipes ended up not fathering any daughters. I wasn't trying to woo, I just what a, I, won't, I won't play the bagpipes. <laughs> you look over, gonna she's, pout she's inside actually, of his tankard. <laughs> she's actually now sitting on a chair that grew out of nowhere uh, and is just kind of sitting while the rest, some of, some of the uh, girls have gone off to do other things. Some are sitting and, and enjoying a meal with you. Some are just sitting in the trees, uh, talking, laughing. Um, you see a couple over doing target practice. They've kind of dispersed now. Like, okay, the 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 theatrics are over. We can all return to what we were doing. Where are my willows at? <laughs> you see a you can see a couple of shaggy green haired uh, ladies uh, just kind of waving at you. I'm they all seem very sleepy. Them. I'm gonna go hang out with them. Gonna have a nap. <laughs> Time so, of... huh? Sorry, go ahead. Huh? No, you. Uh, I was just wondering what time of day it was. You think it was probably a little bit after midday when you finally figured out you were going in circles. And then the walk took a little bit, and then all the proceedings. It's somewhere in mid-afternoon. So, how long have you guys been protecting this uh, forest? And have you been doing it the whole time? As long as there was seedlings, we were here. So, the royal we or literal we? <clears throat> Both. So, uh, you've been protecting the forest the whole time, as, like, the mom lady. Yes. My tree isn't all here. A sapling or a, I guess, in your tongue, cutting of that tree was taken from my original tree and rehomed so that I might start this forest back in the older days. I'm assuming what he's asking was, were there matrons before you in this kind of forest, or have you been here since? I was the first matron of this region, as hmm. this forest is mine. So you said that the tree thing was pulled here from your tree, so... Your tree somewhere else? Or your... My uh, original tree after my new one had reached full growth was repurposed for other things. My life force no longer tethered to it. So... Oh, that answers that question. Apologies if this is too intrusive, but my mind's kind of curious now. Uh, do all kind of trees have a common lineage to one tree or not all trees are tri are tied to a dryad but all dryads are tied to a tree hmm. to one tree and singular tree every tree every dryad for a tree in this forest hmm. wow that's a lot of trees oh there are a lot of girls here Like, Aerodol's just trying to do the math and his head's like, holy shit, this is a big village. <laughs> <laughs> well, like I said, while I, whilst I am always awake, most of my daughters rotate in shifts. How long do you sleep for? Some daughters can sleep for centuries, if necessary, if not oh. needed. Oh, that's a little too long for me. But like a whole half a year? Oh, that'd be great. Just get a big pile of gold. Treasure. Just sleep for half a year. That'd be great. You really are part dragon, aren't you? Yes. Excessively. <laughs> <laughs> like, Aerodol's like daydreaming now at the point. It's just like, yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and for future reference, if you ever enter a wood that is large enough that you even think it might have dryads in it, probably for the best that you offer some tithe. 
Duly noted. Eric all stuffing apples into his face at this point. <laughs> <laughs> what do you guys do for... Well, I asked that already. You guys just take care of the forest. Well, could we... Well, could I help around with that? Pass the time? I mean, I think we're leaving tomorrow. Well, yeah, but until then, we're still staying the night. Uh, that's a good point. The magic that we use to sustain the forest is not one taught. Ah, well, I mean, do patrol or something. I don't know. I'll just relax. <laughs> kind of feels like she feels the forest. Like it's like part of her. I think she Arm is the forest. Fingers. Well, that too, but I mean, yeah. This food's really gonna keep eating this food. <laughs> <laughs> so, anything else anyone would like to do? Peanuts um, over snoozing with the uh, with the willows. But before we all like leave her to go go see peas, is that thunder? No fireworks. Fireworks. Um, can I go up to the mother lady and speak in Sylvan to her? Ooh. You may. Shut what do you off. say? <laughs> A rose, no matter how beautiful, still has to contend with thorns. She replies in Sylvan. I hear this. Uh, I don't know. Old Meg, how discreet are you being? I mean, I'm speaking Sylvan. I assume nobody else knows how to speak in Sylvan. Comprehend languages. Do you speak? No, oh, you cast comprehend languages. I mean, it uh, goes for an hour. Sneaky. Oh, well, this is this is past an hour. Are you trying to be sneaky if you're recasting it? That's fine. Okay. Thorns are only a threat to those who do not live in harmony. Hmm. They're, they're fey, right? They are, yes, they are technically a type of, they are somewhere between plant and fey. Neither one nor the other, truly. Okay. So I'm just uncomfy <laughs> you are scarred you're still in sylvan I am she reaches out and sort of taps uh, your forehead Should have and be. Silence permeates your mind for the first time in quite a while. The voices, the laughter, I... gone. I cannot remove them entirely. That is beyond my power. But as long as you are in my forest, you shall have peace. Thank you. Oh, Mac, they're oranges. You want one? <laughs> <laughs> I'm allergic Cats don't to like citrus. citrus. Wait, what? You can't eat oranges? Well, that sucks. More for me. <laughs> Odin grabs one of the oranges. <laughs> <laughs> Rind and all, just a whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> the mother is actually sitting there looking at you two going, Why did they get an orange? <laughs> Is that not an or uh -oh. what was that? <laughs> <laughs> I did need that a card. Uh I'm just gonna for the rest of the day I'm just gonna kind of use my changeling shape to disguise myself well not disguise, but kind of 
become one of the dryad forms and just okay. kind of observe through the day. They all kind of give you a strange look. And then it's just sort of it's like, okay. Mm, <laughs> that kind of looks like we'll, ac we'll accept this for now. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm just kind of watch and learn. All right. Is there anything anyone else would like to do? I'm good. Uh, excuse me. Siren's just going to stay by either Olmec or Rune, whoever is closest to her at all times. <laughs> I would have killed the women and kept the men. <laughs> For those who don't know, these are dryads based off the Belgarid series. Bless you. It's yes. a very good book series by David Eddings. The Look dryads from the blah, 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 blah series. <laughs> David Eddings, amazing, amazing author. Um, not sponsored. Not sponsored. <laughs> I just caught that, sorry. Uh, so... You all are shown into huts for the night to beds of very comfortable leaves, strangely. Um, and you all get a night's rest unless there are some who want to take watches. Nope. Can't nap. All right. Before you wake up my, in the morning. Before my siesta, I kind of <laughs> reapparate my <laughs> wood Your tools. woodworking tools <laughs> that I dispelled earlier in my haste and panic. Okay. Excuse me. Hmm. No. Uh, you all awake to a strangely brighter morning uh, than you had the day before. As parts of the canopy have, are parted in places where the sun actually peeks through, uh, guided by the also magical blinking lights. Um, anything anyone would like to do? You see Oak down in the clearing, just kind of standing there, arms crossed, kind of tapping her foot. Crawl out of my bug. <laughs> yeah. Are you still sleeping? Wait. Yes, they are. I make my way down. You want an apple? You offering to Oak? Yeah. She kind of takes it. What? Looks at you with a mischievous glint in her eye, unhinges her jaw, and just pops it in whole, and then closes her mouth. I am scaroused. <laughs> I'm very happy I was asleep for this. Did I see this as I come down? Yes, you did. I'm just kind of like wiping my eyes. I'm just like. <laughs> Says the man that's right. shoved a questionable orange in his face hole the night before. <laughs> I didn't unhinge my jaw to do it. I'm just a big <laughs> fucking bird. <laughs> uh, she looks at you after saying, after you said you were scared out. Uh, and says, <laughs> it just kind of gives you a, a smirk and a wink. Good. <laughs> I am no longer. I, I'm ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> Hike on. Yeah. No, no. no, no. All Let's awakes. stay. <laughs> it's all here is freaking peanut yell and just awakes. He wasn't laying on top of leaves. Somehow he managed to get into them and is covered in them. I slept well. <laughs> hop a chop, chop, chop. Let's go. Let's go. I'm just going to shake himself off. Alright, time to go. Let's see, we got Odie, we got Aerodol. Where is Rude? Where's Siren? Stupid and Olmec. Olmec probably went to go ask that mother lady more questions. I'm meditating. He's probably meditating. <laughs> He's doing yoga. <laughs> the, uh, yeah, join Oak. Olmec. Oak points up to where Olmec is just sitting in a tree. He's been up since long before you all. Really sleeping. Rune had With a Rune. question. Hmm? I thought you, you were up there something. with me, right? Yeah, I'm doing oh. yoga with Olmec. Is Siren also? Siren's at the base of the tree, just staying nearby and watching her surroundings. <laughs> she is still not comfy. Bags under her eyes, didn't sleep a fucking wink. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 40 winks, lucky to get two. <laughs> 
Well, I'm ready to go. Hey, no ready to go, guys. Gotta say, no pun intended, but I guess they have to limber up first. <laughs> <laughs> I hate really you. Really went out on a limb for that, huh? Uh, I'm just branching out. <laughs> leaf it be. We're just trying to leaf. Yeah, let's just leaf. <laughs> Please, somebody stone me to death. That's not a tree pun. <laughs> Oak looks at you and goes, if you insist. No. We, we, we insist. I'm not going to die in this forest. I want to die in this forest. <laughs> All of you guys doing your stretchy thingies. I mean, girls. Well, mainly just guys. Oak looks at... Um... <laughs> Oak looks at Odie. You know... A lot of men have said that. <laughs> they always start out. Lie. They always start out saying one thing and then change their mind. <laughs> Gonna look up at Olmec and Rune. You guys done yet? Waiting for you. I'm down here with my bug. I'm good to go. Can I like do a triple somersault? Kick flip. I Only five thousand. Make a make a dex check. Dex, not acrobatics. Oh, yes. Yeah, acrobatics. Thank you. Yeah. Acrobatics. Okay, because oh. I'm curious. How's the landing? It's like one foot that'll, three that'll point landing. Depend. Well, it's more of a. Nineteen plus six. Nineteen plus six. Oh. Uh, if you so choose, you do your trick and then you land almost in like uh, the crane pose with one foot on the ground and one kind of cocked over to the side. <laughs> Go off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <Go off. laughs> Siren, come on. Time to go. She Probably was like happy. right behind where old Mike landed. It was like, oh, yes, I want to leave, please. So fast. My tail just wraps around her. Aww. Oak just kind of walks up and pats you on the shoulder. It's okay. Who, Siren? You're safe. Uh, yeah, she oh. she walks up to Siren and pats her on the shoulder. It's okay. You're safe now. <laughs> yeah, it's not spring. I still don't feel safe. Honestly, we'd have probably you would probably been the first one to be let go in two centuries. Hey, congratulations! Plap, plap. The music you was make quite it, nice. We, we appreciated it. Yeah. You make it past two centuries? I'm sorry? No. Hmm. No, I'm asking her if she makes it past two centuries. <laughs> no. Uh -huh. No, I meant the first one to be released in two centuries, as in we oh. haven't released anyone in two centuries. I thought you were going to hold her for two <laughs> centuries and then let her decaying bones back into the forest. <laughs> Go on, you certain time, go on, get. <laughs> that is an option, centuries? I guess. <laughs> no, no, it's not. She's ours. <laughs> Mother's been around for... for a lot longer than two centuries. Damn. You guys can't call me Grandpa anymore while I'm here. Yes, the fuck I yeah. will. <laughs> yeah. You're the only male who's old enough. See? All that gets it. High five. And if you call Mother Grandma, well, I'll shank you. I never said that. <laughs> Never said that at all. <laughs> Is Olmec leaving me they hanging? Like, like, oh, okay. Actually, um, that's a good question. Does she not have any granddaughters? Technically, yes. At this point, she does. Not very many. Hmm. Not many. Not many have reached that stage of their life cycle yet. I haven't. In over two centuries. We are slow growers, much like hmm. our trees. Hmm. Much like Odie. I've I feel that on a spiritual level. You would find you're, you would find you're no grower, not slow grower. <laughs> you would find many more um, matron possibles uh, or matron appearance. Hmm. I don't know. Your language is strange. You would find many more possible matrons in the high forest. Hmm. Sounds fancy. Well. I'm good to go. Pete, I'm still walking by beside Olbeck, waiting for a high five. <laughs> Just like the biggest, fluffiest murder mitten gives you the softest high five ever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Oh, Max, soft paws. <laughs> I just pictured the fucking uh, uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger just like, Dylan, you <laughs> <laughs> Man, you son of a bitch. Um, all right, so Oak looks at all of you. Keep up. And she just poof, runs off into the forest. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> you quickly exit the clearing and immediately lose track of her. Ah, fuck. <laughs> hey, old <Olbeck>. man. Marco! <laughs> <laughs> Which way is east? Oh, old, old, old Which? You never eat there. To the east? <laughs> Can I what? <laughs> Can I try and track her? Uh, as you start to look around, her, she, like... You you see her swing from the under uh, from the overbrush from a branch and just like come like Spider Man face to face with you. I'm just kidding. Come on. She leaps down and starts walking. Okay. Ah. Toad Brown. <laughs> Toad Brown. <laughs> God. All right. You all travel for the full extent of the day. Uh, at one point, uh, there is even a uh, towards the end of your journey. There is a large body stream, not not a not a river, but just a large stream, enough that you would have to swim across, but not too much that you can't see the other side. A um, creek. How it, uh, the creek's too small. Um, it's the almost like a branch of a river, so one that's not too bad. Um, there is a tree. That has fallen from one side and bra- and uh, bridged over to the other. That she takes you across. How strong is the current? Um, it seems to not be too strong. Like probably strong enough to where if you didn't do anything, you would probably float with it. But not strong enough to where you couldn't easily swim to one side or the other, or even kind of stay in place. I jump in the water and swim across. Okay. She kind of looks over at you. Oh, it's so tempting to call the snappers. Do it. Do it. Do it, do it, no, do it, do it, do it. then he would be dead, and I would have... My mother would be angry. Can we Can settle on a me light, lady? Call them? I didn't... I mean, you wouldn't have done anything. It's just, my, it's just me at that point. Listen, no. you guys don't like the don't F know. word, but I have another L word that doesn't mix with water. They're fish. I eat them. What? Mm-hmm. What? <laughs> Lightning. Uh, Shocky hands. It's not a fish. Oh, and she keeps moving. <laughs> as, as we get across, I go, could we not have settled on a light maybe? <laughs> as, <laughs> as, she, as she gets across and waits for uh, Zahn to get not to Zahn. the other huh? side. Who? Sorry. Aerodol. Aerodol. <laughs> <laughs> to be Zahn, fair, what? the bunny did say Lightning. It, yeah, it messed me up. I, uh, <laughs> All of a sudden, uh, behind Aerodol, you just see Zahn parted the water to fucking walking <laughs> across. <laughs> um, as you get to, the, as everyone reaches the other side, she kind of gives you a mischievous grin and then uh, kind of whistles, and you see the largest snapping turtle-like creature that you have ever seen just slowly surface. <laughs> It's easily, <laughs> it, it could probably dam uh, the stream if it wanted to, if it really wanted to. I didn't know Dragon Turtles jumped. came this far in. <laughs> I just pictured as Arendelle's cl- crawling out of the river, it just kind of... Hug up, <laughs> <laughs> it grabs my fucking tail and yanks that bitch out of the fucking water faster. Hey, <laughs> stay in the water. <laughs> Not food. I don't think it's a dragon turtle, but might be a cousin of some sort. Are you related to a turtle, Aerodol? What? You have a turtle in your lineage? Are you cousins? This is relatives? Second cousins. When we get Twice out of the forest, I'm having a barbecue, and you're invited. <laughs> oh, sweet. Okay. <laughs> you travel for maybe another few hours and before you know it you are on the edge of the forest
That was a oh, day? Damn. The magic helps it along. Oh, I, I mean, I suppose if he can just kind of move us in circles, we can just kind of like... Quite. Hmm. Impressive. No way. Ha. Huh. You do, you do uh, see that the sun is no longer overhead, and you do see kind of the light of sunset uh, kind of lighting the uh, area before you. Hey, uh, to the south, oh. you actually uh, see, pretty much as far as the eye can see, a small field before it just turns into wetland, as far as you can see. Uh, directly in front of you is a uh, sort of a small mountain ridge not super high up um but some uh but it, it it could be considered at least cliffs um on the other side of that is river moot is oh that to the south no no the ridge ah and to the south is that the evermore that is the evermores yes Hey, oh, quick Hello, question. Right? So, yes. Bubbler said that we need to have a basket of stuff. Um, wh what if what if we don't have a basket? I guess we better find a basket then. Make one. You all seem to be pretty handy. Well, I was, looks at Odie. I was just kind of checking if there was an alternative <laughs> that we could do if we were in a bit of a pickle. We could just Any use your mug. No. Anything of the earth shall suffice. Oh, cool. Okay. Like a mug. No. Not <laughs> below the surface. No metals, if you can avoid it. Well, I was thinking Stone like is a, rock. a last resort. Got it. And, and of course, the offering shall be the bounties of the earth. Yeah, that was, that was just for me. I'm not going to tell anyone else that. It's got to be basket. Just, that's... Inner circle. Hmm. Because, you know, for getting chased by a giant, we gotta come to your forest and, like, oh shit, we forgot the basket. So. <laughs> cool. You would also have to wait one day. <laughs> Add details. Yeah. I'm sure if um, your, your stories of giant slain are true, you won't have any problems. Nope. Oh. Except for your mom's friend. Supposedly he's a big deal. He is quite the big deal. Kind of want to fight him. Just a little bit. Mm. Not to the death. Just, just, just a little just, sparring match. Just, just a little just a little slap. Just a little tilly. Yeah. A little, little tussle. A little scrap. I'll make you join me, right? Just a little bit. Only if I get to watch you die. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> wow, well that got morbid fast. But that was uncharacteristically that mean. <laughs> <laughs> I think I shall bid you all farewell. And, um... Bless you. Wait, sorry. <laughs> Go back. <laughs> Have fun... Doing whatever you're doing. Can't There was like three voices there. I just said can't do. She, oh, she just slow. Uh, she just walks away into the brush and slowly disappears. Are you around? I start walking. All right. As you all start walking up the ridge. That is where we're going to end it for tonight. Uh, thank you to everyone who tuned in or is listening to this in podcast format. We hope you enjoyed this little very RP heavy uh, episode. I had a ton of fun. I hope you all did too. Um, join us next week for the Tales of Archeron run by... Got to look at my camera real quick so I know which way to point. This goober! Um, That's me! Yeah. Again, hope you all enjoyed. Hope you rejoin us once again. Uh, if you want to join any of our antics, we do play video games on the regular on our Discord. 
uh, server. Once again, links down in the doobly-doo for all of our stuff. Uh, we hope to see you there. Uh, hope you had a good time. And yeah, am I missing anything, anyone? The forest provides! The forest, the forest provides! How to train your Tomorrow is silly shit nice. with... <laughs> I need to figure out where to point this guy. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Minecraft or Sea of Thieves. We'll figure out what we do tomorrow. Sea of Thieves. All right. Well, until next time, everyone. Have a good bye. whatever time of day it is for you. And bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye, everybody. Bye. -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.